Hello, come here, buddy. How you doing? Welcome everybody. Welcome, welcome. Where my glasses go? Get ahead of the game so I can actually see later. Oh boy. Why is this taking so long to get? Oh, there we go. I was like, it's taking a long time to get the shoreline. This is the exact spawn I didn't want. Because I did need to reload. Okay, that was BP. My free med. So we need to go to cottages, and I also, uh... Kinda wanna check power, because I have Hepsky. F1 grenade, okay.
Did I late spawn? Wow, I, uh, I super late spawned, I think. I don't think I sat there for two minutes. Did I? I may have. Point we need to be a little bit more careful because we're going to start converging on people. Dang, that's a bush. Fuck. I'm a little confused. Like, there's no way this guy's alive. That was like three shots smack dab in the middle of his face. After this round, we're going to have to make some hard decisions and lose some loot, though. We're kind of maxed out and have been for a bit. Right, so Scav Sniper is up, which is good. How many shots that? What? Scaths is like, they're getting quieter. They're being a little bit more sneaky. A little bit more sneaky sneak. Unless that was a player, which is possible, but I doubt it.
Oh.
chat. I don't hear him at all. He was still out there. Oh, he was just sitting right by the front door. Uh, without, without killing those two scabs, there's no way for me to tell what actually happened or how, many, how much damage I actually did to him. I wish you would give me a further breakdown. Oh uh, yeah, our stomach was blacked out there for quite a while. God, green tea is awful. All right. Well, here's the deal, though. Hopefully we spawn Swamp. Or down to downtown would be dope. Because at that point, I'm just literally getting in and getting out.
After this, maybe we'll run a, a run an interchange with an actual kit. That was quick. Oh, late spawn. Oh, very late spawn. Holy crap. So we have tunnel. What I might do is fall the wall down. Because it's a bit a minute, so spelling it in a minute. A lot of people have already moved. I kind of want to go around this way, though. Big issue of the sniper scabs here, though. No sniper scav. Don't think. But I also don't see a body, so. Kinda sounds like fighting a cottage. I'm actually gonna peel off right here. Not heal.
I don't think we healed. I don't know why my guy just all of a sudden started huffing and puffing like that. I wanna go wide, right? I don't have anything for range right now, so. Be a big risk. I was hoping they were gonna leave me. I didn't have anything on me. There's no way I was gonna win that. They were garbage. I could have. Wow, they were bad. Does it tell me how many times they hit me? Oh god, they're using TKM EKOs. Oh shit. That's why. <laughs> Oh my god, I should have fought that. I bet they were low level. <laughs> Why would you run TKM?
Hold on. I wish you guys get good spawn for the cottages. It's only what? That or hillside wouldn't be bad. Like tunnel spawns. Just gotta watch out for someone spawning on Svelte in the beach. Time now. There we go. I just want to get this quest done so I can stop going to shoreline for a bit. We've been to shoreline so much recently. It's kind of late spawn me again, isn't it? Later, Arby. Okay, we're right on time. Um, oh my god, the spawn again? You guys are also hearing footprints right here, right?
Ok. Oh shit, he's there. Oh fuck. Ouch, ouch. Did he spawn like after I pushed down? I did not see him up there. That surgery skill up.
think he was checking the stash.
have been a scab, but I don't know. Safe is locked.
What? How? This is big risk, but this is what I'm worried about right here. Salada.
Ooh. Chat. We've finally done that mission. Barely made it out alive, though. Holy. Blacked out stomach twice. Oh, those are both scavs that I killed. Dang. I thought that guy by the campsite was not a scav. Damn, he was legging me. Collateral from stomach. So either that was a player or that was a scav boss or a raider with a M4. It's worth some money. CMS kit. The helmet. Nope. Power cord. Power cord. Oh, three six 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 AP. Okay. therapist Coolio so I'm just gonna put these on the market Market. Thirty-five K. Paracord's selling for a decent amount right now. Got a shotgun I can go into factory with.
15k. Power cords usually sell pretty fast, so. Actually, yeah, because we're going to interchange, so we're going to bring an actual real backpack now. I didn't really mean to not bring a backpack last game. tasks. I need to kill six more people with a pack of vests. Okay. Let's do a scabby boy. I'm gonna BRB and then we'll do a scabby boy to interchange. BRB chat.
All right, chat, we're back. Just see if we can get a uh, reserve. See if my air conditioner is on now. It's getting hot in here, so hot. <clears throat> oh, we're in a game. I think what I should do is actually look up the missions because I know there's a specific spawn for these things. Why well, are we awaiting session to start? <laughs> oh, I need this cowboy hat.
waiting session start. Why? Why is this taking so long? I've never seen an away a waiting session start this long. Control Alt Delete Task Manager. Looks like we'll just restart our game. Why is this not full screen now? There we go. Ready? Can we not crash, please? I definitely would have disconnected anyways there. What's the good ammo for the PPSH? I'm pretty sure it uses 760 by 25, right? PSTGZH. Pretty much it's a leg meta gun. Besides the mag, can you upgrade the PPSH at all? session start. So, what is the task I need here? Oh, uh, let's see. Military. 
battery, Tarkov. Sitting on or near tanks? So I just have to find stuff. Okay, I have gunpowder. That's cool. I don't have enough, a big enough backpack, which is cool. Okay, that's kind of close.
scared chat. Holy frickin' ammo. Someone's on the turret. Okay. Alianka. Coffee. Mayonnaise. Pressure gauge. Scav lands, okay. Um, I have no idea where any of this is. So hole in the fence is back where we came. Because I think we're behind pawn. Yeah, we're definitely behind pawn. So the hole in the fence is back there. CP fence is top right. Heating pipe is bottom left. So the heating pipe is down low. Okay. No idea what I'm doing or what I, where I need to go. Shanka, should we need? Oh God! I think we just need to dip, dip, tip, chip.
Kind of lie, the power kind of sketched me out. Okay, so I'm here. I need to go left, down to the wall. Is there a 2D? I'm here, I think. I'm here. So if I have sewer manhole, oh, no backpack required. Dang. Hold on. Oh, seven is CP fence. Four is eight. It's up there. That can't be right. Clean 3D. Heating pipe. H hole in the fence. F.
am I? Maybe I'm here, so I'm gonna take it right out of here and go down. Not a bad raid. Not a bad raid at all. Nothing we were looking for. We got two Alianka out of it. Which is well worth. We also got mayonnaise, which I'm pretty sure sells for a decent amount. And I got a cowboy hat. No, wait. We have this thing now. I forgot. I also have this. Coffee going there? Yeah, mayo, milk. All right, where's your next chat? That was a decent. That was a decent scab read. I'll take it. I think we gotta interchange, um, try to get the manifest. Some more scav kills. What else do I have here? Oh, I have all my pack armor. Which we sell on a four thirty four four. Sodium, so fourteen K. Sells for twenty six K. All right. The sling bag is empty.
FMJ forty three. I'm pretty sure is like like one of the worst. Yeah. Is it you who wanted? Yeah, you want the cowboy hats. I also need seven Yushankas as well. It's not what I want to do at all. I want to try to get to 2.5 mil today. That's the goal. I'm going to keep this because I'm probably going to run a budget AK into factory at some point. All right, so here I think is what we're gonna do. We're gonna, actually I might bring PPSH too. It's not a bad budget gun. Just really have to be able to run around naked in factory. So what I might do is I'm gonna do an interchange run. We're gonna try to get one, maybe two manifests. See if Kaiba's open. If Kaiba's open, go plant the camera. Try not to die. If I can plant the camera, I'm fine. Like, I'd honestly just plant the camera. Um. Yeah. I got supply. So we'll do this, probably go factory once or twice to use these two guns and then the shotgun. Get some kills. And then go to interchange again if we're not done. Who knows? There everyone may just be like an in and out group for interchange. Think we're good? Oh, I need ears. Hold on. Do I have I have contacts? How's it work? No PP ninety one Ketter next. Interchange fifteen oh two. This is probably going to be a slower raid because we need the manifests. Um, I want to try to get them all done in one go. And then by maybe the towards the end, um, we'll try to go Kaiba. We'll risk it. Did I reload my mags? I don't know if I reloaded my mags. We're gonna find out. Either the, the hard way or the easy way. Hopefully the easy way. This means it takes two seconds at the start of the game. It's not like that game I went through the, an entire game. Didn't shoot a single round. Didn't see a single person. And I had no, no way about my gun. And I went hunting for people too, which would have sucked. Would have gotten the first gunfight and then click. Hopefully someone will get on soon. I don't see anybody on yet. It is hot in here though. Hot, hot, hot. Okay, I'm gonna get the fan set up.
Oh, it's raining and I have contacts on. We're gonna be late spawn, aren't we? I'll take these off. Oh god. Where am I? I'm here. So I'm next to Ollie.
Holy mother of pearl is friggin' thunder. Okay. Yes, I do. Welcome to the stream. How you doing today? I hear anything. I did make a lot of noise, so I kind of need to be careful. Go. What's this one called? Database? Okay. Part one. Oh, there's more parts. This. Okay. All right. So we have to cross the entire side of Hamel.
Not a secret way. I don't hear anything, guys. There's been like no gunshots. Kaiba's right here, isn't it? Yeah, it's straight and left. I think I'll do the Kaiba separately because I don't think power is on. Nor do I know how to tell if power is on. I don't play interchange much. Upstairs. Guys, I, I literally don't hear anything. It's that one gunshot, but... I did hear a nade at the start. heard something I hear a scab boy where is this manifest Now this office goes straight into idea. We need to go to the back of idea. So this is going to go in the hallway right before idea. I can't tell if I'm hearing my footsteps or another set of footsteps.
Oh, it's a scav. I got a scav. I think there's two players on the other side of this door. Hear anything? Could have been upstairs. I mean, vertical sounds not the greatest right now. This one out. We already have two manifests. Also kind of looking for a propane tank or alkali. Those two things would be super clutch. How many people can spawn in this map? I thought it was like 10.
Gabby boy? Where's this manifest? Is it in here? Well, let me, uh... Find a good place to hide. Oh, wait. Yes, Kunyep. We need scab kills, so I'm probably gonna kill these scabs and dip out. Manifest. Not first shot, not a the headshot. I'm so confused in that gunfight. I heard him breach a door. He breached the door. Oh, he's got an alpha? search it. We've got all three manifests. Let's just dip out. Oh, um. Because we're going to have an idea, so we need to go out idea. Gonna dip. Nope. Is he open? Alright, let's 
way. We aren't going to worry about any other uh, loot spots right now. We do have three objective uh, pieces on us, so we're just going to worry about getting out. We do have to be careful. This extract is heavily camped. SMB rounds? Okay. Let's get a propane tank out of this run, but what's our timer? Sixteen. Adelaide, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream. All right, cool. Not a bad run. We got an objective done, so. And quite a few scav kills. It was like, what, four scav kills? Five? Six? Okay. Blunt damage. Super performance slug. Literally did six damage to me. That was it. Congrats, you did absolutely nothing. I am so proud of you, Scabby. I think that first guy was a player, though, because he didn't lock on to me like a normal scav. And he also walked into the corner, so that first guy was definitely a scav. The second guy was definitely AI. And the fact that guy that literally missed every shot on me. Oh, Ragman. Turn in, turn in, turn in, turn in. Complete. What's next? Get Ollie cargo rope documents. Okay. So looks like we're gonna go back to Ollie. Another cowboy hat. So I need nine more scav kills. Oh, I get good armor, okay. Oh, I get sword ends. Yay. 23,000 rubles. Thanks, man. Do, do they have to be found in raid? Pretty sure they have to be found in raid. Do I one shot? Oh, I got 18 rounds of SMB. Nice. So juice box. I'm actually going to empty this and then sell it. Okay. Can't do that. Light bulb, UV lamp, power cord, power cord. Two power cords. Okay. GM count. Because uh, I think I have two more alpha. Yeah, I have two more alpha rigs already, so I'm going to sell this one. Slickers, Tarcola. Just a decent amount of ammo. Are 
reload all the mags. We'll put this in here, this in here. We'll put that on. BP will go in here. Factory, ooh, factory key's gonna go on us because we're gonna go with factory real quick. We're gonna put our, oh, we can't put our M rig one. Let's sell the alpha rig and then we can go to the M1. Bam, bam. 35k. I remember we don't take a backpack into factory. There's no, there's literally no need for need for a backpack into factory. We'll go the shotgun first, and it's not gonna let me take the mag out. Okay. So eight round mag, solid. That that's actually real nice. Um, let's see here. What do we have for shotgun shells? Do we have magna buckshot? Put these in here. Apparently these are good rounds. Put that in there, that in there. And then 20 stack of that. Okay. Um, we're gonna put this here first so we can reclaim our pack armor. So we can get pack armor kills. I hate being forced to do something in a game. Eh, I'm not going to worry about that. Absolutely hate it. I hate being forced to do stuff in a certain way. Do I have that? I do have another CMS kit. Um, camera. Open key. CMS. Just because I have two one-use CMS kits. Alright. Let's go see how this goes. So we got a super performance shell in the gun. So we need to be aware of that because that's not going to do much pen damage. It might break somebody's leg. Because it's going to be... Oh, I know it's at the bottom. So if we load it in, the Super Fortress is going to be last. So you remember that. So the last... The last shell in our gun is the worst shell. The first and the last. The middle seven are going to probably hurt quite a bit. Because they're 50 cal slugs. Which is the second best slug. Doesn't have as much AP damage, but it has... A, the, a good amount of flash damage. Hopefully we spawn forklifts, honestly. Forklifts or office spawn. Or the left of forklifts. That'd be nice, too. Not hallway, the other one. I mean, hallway would be bad, because we can just sprint to uh, office. Hopefully get some beef there. So we need six more kills with the pack of 6B47 helmet. And then that mission's done. We should be able to get that today. Maybe do some pistol runs, maybe do some shotgun runs. We do have a lot of crappy guns, so we'll probably bring all those and Try to get something with them.
Ты что давай ты, схмы? Давай, мы тих! What? He took three AP-20 shots? 261 damage? Excuse me? Okay. Wow. That was fun. Big rip. Wow, I did not expect that. Ma I feel like Magnum Buckshot is like the only shell to use now. We're gonna bring a shotgun again. Actually, hold on, we're gonna do this with a shotgun first. I wish you could just unload it. Excuse me? I don't have any Magnum Buckshot, so we're gonna go Jaeger. Uh, this one. No, oh, they lowered it to 200. It used to be 250. Magnum Buckshot is just stupid. It really is. I'm slightly salty about that. Oh, I had an M67 grenade on me too. Oops. It will. So we're going back to here, prepper, receive, do pack of armor first, and then a 6B47 helmet, and accept. I can't believe that guy lived through that. That's interesting. We don't need a rig. We're good. Oh, I am wounded. Open. Oh, heal all. Heal all. It's gonna be a minute till we get to level 40. Actually, let's do Scabby Boy Run. Interchange. We have so many magazines, it's not even funny. Part of me is like, we should definitely get rid of some of these, and part of me is like, but I'm gonna need them. Like, this is literally all just gun parts and, oh, there's a spot there. This is literally just gun parts and, like, good stuff, too. That's the thing. Cool. All right, let's go. Should do we have enough for a scab run? The armor slot there. Could finagle some things here to fit something bigger. Screw it, let's go. Um, we'll go, we'll go scab boy. 
What do you guys want? Uh, you guys want to go resort on a shoreline? You guys want to go interchange? Or reserve. Actually, let's go reserve. We made out real good in reserve earlier. Probably going to die this time, but we, we made, out, made out good. Oh, my back is killing me today, chat. Do I get any one of those back cushions? Got a butt cushion? No, I need a back cushion. Or just a whole new chair in general. PP ninety one suppressed. Is it the semi auto or the full auto one? So there's the PP ninety one. There's a PP ninety one Keto. There's a PP ninety one something else. And there's I think there's four of them. If we can come out of here again with two uh, Aliancas, it'd be golden. While we are match matchmaking chat, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. Go BRB. Are we in yet, chat? Bro, we're not in? Are you serious? We're really not in yet. Really. Alright, we'll back out, go back in. We'll try it twice. If it doesn't work on twice, then we'll go interchange. I do need propane tanks. However, I don't think I have a backpack on this guy. So we're kind of out of luck there. What I really need is the 50 cal rounds and the battery. Oh, the game froze. Everything froze. What? There we go. We're good. Thank you guys for joining. Make sure you guys drop a like, comment, and subscribe.
Hit the bells when I do go live. What is today, Saturday? I'm going to go live tomorrow for a couple of hours, not long. Probably be a short stream. And then Monday night, Tuesday night, we have D&D. Wednesday, we're back to... Uh, This game, Tarkov. There we go. Why does reserve have to be so hard to get into? Reserve and Shoreline mode. Probably like the two best places to scav is like the longest time to get into an actual game. Loading map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. Should we PMC on? See, I don't I don't know anything about reserve, so I don't know the flow of the map yet. And I only have big boy stuff right now. Besides the AK. And a crappy couple guns. So I'd like to get the 50 cal. I just want to get the 50 cals in the military battery done. Although I think you can get them on any map, but reserve has the most common spawns. Because I've definitely gotten 50 cals on the, uh, the 50 BMG rounds on the, um, what do you call it? Customs. I've gotten them on. Never seen a military battery anywhere but the market. If this hits three minutes again, we'll go to interchange. I hate sitting in lobbies this long. Reserve is such a hit or miss when you're a scav. Which makes sense. I mean, it's got good loot. The audio changed for a minute, and I thought that was going to be... Uh... The, the get in. Almonds are like the best snack ever. Just point that out there. All right, let's go to interchange. It's a pain to get into a game sometimes. Scav. No resistance. Let's go short line. Mm, Charlie's in there hit and miss too, so we'll go here.
feel like my stomach's just like eating itself alive right now. I just want good stuff. Just give me a propane tank or alkali. Either one. We'll probably go back to factory. Hopefully get a hopefully actually get a kill. Cause that was kind of actual that was BS. There was no reason that guy shouldn't have eaten two AP twenty slugs. With no armor. Oh, we have a Zariah too? Dope. So we're on Ideas side, I think. Oh, crap. Okay. I'll come back for that. The power's already on. It's been loaded. Yep. Scabby boy around here with a backpack. Oh, oh, slickers, hopes. Sometimes scabs spawn down here, so let's go check down here real quick. Just literally any backpack would be fine. A friggin' sling bag would be fine. Let's see if there's any dead bodies. All right, let's go in. If we get a backpack and have time, because um, how far are we in? Are we 21? Do I get 21 minutes left? Um, we'll go back out and try to grab that PSU. I need it for the hideout, so. 
I don't really want to buy them because they're like 37k. God, a drill. No. We have here Emercom Railway. I'll see what I might what I might do is find a scav, kill him, take his backpack, and just go get the PSU and get out. We got decent stuff already. so much blue gunpowder. It's not even funny. <laughs> Chat, this is gonna be a quick one. We do have to go back into Ollie as a PMC, so. I'm not too worried about going to Ollie for propane tank. I don't know why I shot. Let's uh, reload though. Hold on. Okay. Is there anything ever like outside here for like loot? Is not there anymore. Okay. Okay. 
way, hold on. Uh, which way is closer? Definitely railway. I feel like railway is definitely less camped. For sure. Anybody in there? Nothing there. Somebody right up here. <laughs> ah, excuse me. Wow. I don't see anybody in the tower. Sorry, guys. We got sniped to the back of the tower. We were very upset. So if we get out with this PSU, I think we need three more. Three more and then pretty much we're gonna buy the rest of what we need after we get the PSUs. Because the PSUs are the biggest worry because they cost the most. I mean PSUs, wires, what else do we need? What do you need? PSU's wire? What do you need for level 3? I want this. God, what do you need for level 3? PBM. Like that. Oh! Shows are worth a decent amount right now in the market. Shoot me. Please don't explode, camper. All right, not bad. I'm curious what those uh, night vision goggles are going for. I just want to sell the cat, that's all I care about. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Uh, I think we're good there. Let's 
So we need to also get database level part two. So I don't know where that is. Database part two, because that's the Ollie. So I need logistics office key, unlocks the door to Ollie department office. Okay, uh, where can you get this? So the blue car in customs is said the factory building or in jackets and scabs, okay. I might already have that one, I'm not 100% sure though. And might is a very, very, uh, Long shot. What do we got? 28? That's not terrible. I'm not going to lie, except it's a little worse. Diaper mod, 10k, not worth it. I'll use it. Why is the Ketter going for 35k? Or why are people selling the Ketter for 50k? What? Am I missing something? Corrugated hose. 25. Okay, let me see what I need for the the generator first because we need generator part three so we need two more PSUs relays spark plugs should I just buy it ooh they're up a little high right now Relays and spark plugs. I think spark plugs are like 10. Oh, they're like seven right now, okay. No space in your stash. Fine. Let's see what we can make. Do we have anything to make? Two power cards can get eight wires. I don't know if that's worth it. Laboratory, can I make anything here? Uh, I don't want 60 round mags. Med station. Oh, can we make IFX. That's about it. Okay, so we're at 1.9 right now. Um, horse we can sell, gauge we can sell. Good. So this is gonna go for 9K. Gauge 38, okay. Ram stick for nineteen eighty eight for nineteen eighty eight zero. CPU fan as well. Oh god. CPUs have dropped so much. We're just gonna, oh no, that's not what I want. I want, just throw the mags away. 
This code, yes. No! Just go away! Then we can sell that. This is empty, right? We can sell that. Fragment, sell. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Thirty-eight. Teen. Oh, we're definitely gonna hit two mil. All right, we're, we're gonna hit two mil today. My goal is to hit two point five mil, though. All right, we're going to factory. Of course, be green. What's going on, boss? Oh, what's going on, man? Chilling, chilling. I was just about to go in our raid. Did you look at that? You just got up? Yeah, I just got up. No change. I went into. I found a PSU which I need for the level 3 of the generator. And I couldn't have a backpack, so I ran into idea. I found a couple more things, killed the scab for the backpack, went back, got the PSU, and got out. Yeah. I was like, I don't want to buy a $37,000 fucking PSU. Parkour, man. Didn't have a backpack, you made it work. Let's see what this gives me. What is the benefits of this stock? Oh, this stock's way better. Goodbye, Sotbod. Hello, Viper. I think Viper's the meta mod. For, like, AR platforms. Is it? It's that one, or, or one of the Gen 3 ones. I have the Gen 3 on my... one of my M4s. What does this one have? This guy has an E mod. I don't know about those ones. I know there's like the the hand card that everybody uses. I don't remember what, remember what that one's called. Max level mechanic cells, I believe. Uh, Hello, rotate. Thank you. I'll put that one on that. Here. And then we'll put the. What's better than this one? The. EBR Gen 3, or, okay, the SOP mod's better. Or the, not SOP mod, the Viper, or the E mod. Items incompatible. What do you mean? Oh, wait, I know why. There might be something you gotta take off first. Uh, because it's got a buffer 2 built into the stock for the Gen 3s. Mechanic, sell. You gonna do a factory run? Totally about that. I got a ton of, uh, ton of insurance back and now I have like two, three extra bosons and a ton of armor. So it's good. I got a lot of pack armor I need to claim and all that needs to go to factory so I can actually get kills. I've been getting so unlucky on spawns though. Like no one's going to the spawns where I spawn, so I'm not getting any beef off the start. I I killed a thick boy today. <laughs> I brought really crappy rounds into the game. I was like, you know, I'm gonna bring this AK. I'm gonna bring one extra mag. I'm just gonna run. He was healing on the top of the staircase closest to um, I think it's gate zero, and he was sitting there healing. And I popped my head up, and I just fucking mag dumped every round into him, killed him, and then his friend killed me. But I was like, I don't care, I got the thick boy. I'll take it. Shit. I don't know why he was healing there. I was like, guys, you have the office up there. Go hide in the office and heal. What are you doing? Wanted the beef, man. I don't know about you, but I do that a lot too, where I heal near the beef and get killed for it. it happens pretty often. And then I had 286 damage with AP 20 slugs under a scab, and he fucking one-shot me. I was so fucking mad. I was like, there's no way. Because this shell would have gone straight down through his chest, through his stomach, probably into his leg. And, like, I I hit two shots with AP 20 slugs, and he survived and just one-tapped me. I was like, that's, that's, come on. 
I don't like using that round currently. In this in this patch, I think AP20 slug is bugged or broken or something. Yeah. It's done the same thing. It's it's all Magnum Buckshot. <laughs> no point in using anything else. Oh, what's sold? CPU fan sold. Yay. The CPU fans are going for garbage right now. Yeah, they they were going for a good price the other day, like 16k. And and now they're going for garbage. Too. I want to sell some of my junk. Forgot I have two power cords, and they're going for seventeen nine ninety right now. Oh. I'm already about to upgrade my intelligence center. Finally. Nice. I'm trying to get that mission done so that I can get the uh, the stuff for it. Because there's uh, there's a mission that you get for someone that gives you. Two Intel folders. Damn, that would actually save a lot of money. Yeah. Rather than spending the 320k. Hey, but there's a great, a great med station level three craft. Two Vaselines for a pile of meds, a shampoo, and three bars of soap. That's a pretty damn good craft. Yeah. I want to sell some of my gunpowder. I didn't realize I had seven of them. Which gunpowder? Blue. I'm gonna sell five of them. Yeah, I feel like blue's like the low tier. Red's yeah. the one that everybody wants. Red's for like making almost all the good bullets and I think blue's just like a secondary thing you need for making some of the good bullets. I think there's one you told me that needs all of them, red, blue, and green. Yeah. Forty five K for a gauge. Yeah. I don't think I need it for anything, so Bye bye. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think you do need it for upgrading your security or something. Yeah, uh, I've already right. done security. Oh, okay. I mean, worst case scenario, I just buy it later. I find a decent amount of them, so. Oh, we're almost at 2.1 mil. Joe, you're stacking up the money. I need to get my shit back up. I'm going to buy right now. Dude. So I, I scabbed on reserve today. One, it took forever to get into. Two, I walked out with two Eliankas, and I was like, dope, I'm out. And then the power came on, and a lot of footsteps going on, started going on above me. I was like, oh, I don't know where the staircases are in this map. I don't know what's happening. I'm just in this little bunker scared right now. Oh, boy. It was scary. I hate to say it. I'm a, I'm a little bit of a bitch. I've done, like, at least a few hours of offline runs of reserve. And that's that's usually what determines whether or not I can play a map. If I just offline it enough, I'll learn it. That's but, a good point. But that button that got pressed next to you, where you hear the eh, eh, thing, that's the that's the hermetic bunker door. That's one of the exfils. Oh, for, okay. Uh, for reserve, you press that button. You have five minutes to go there. Okay, five or ten, I don't remember. But it will turn off eventually. Oh, really? But when you press that button, there's a chance, or I think it's going to happen regardless. I think, like, it's 100% chance that raiders will spawn right next to the Hermetic Bunker door. They'll spawn, ah. like, where the, where the train is. Just fucking farm that all day. Yeah, maybe. Oh, if they wouldn't fucking kill you. <laughs> Dude, there's three level three, three, three level ones waiting to get in the factory right now. Oh, my God. You know what, though? I, I have heard that a lot of people do that at the beginning of life. They'll, they'll go in as hatchlings and pistollings with their BP, press the button at reserve, and just start farming fucking raiders. I mean, not a bad idea, though. I mean, I get it. And what I'm actually thinking about is next wife, I might have a strat. Let's go to labs ASAP, bro. Right off the bat. There's going to be nobody there. And that, the people that are there are going to be naked, just like us. That That's a good point, though. Like... Actually, I never thought of that. I was like, once we get a, once we get lab card key cards at the start, just go straight there. Just go to labs, farm it, farm the shit out of it. Get the biggest backpack we can, get the best stuff we can, and go in with it. Take armor well, and stuff. Actually, I'm gonna have EOD edition, so I'm gonna have thick boy stuff off the start. So if we get a labs key card off the start, like in a random scav thing, like I'm just gonna bring that gear, and if I lose it, I lose it. If not, then I'm fucking decked out for labs right off the start. 
Oh yeah, because what would I what I would do is fill up my stash with lab stuff, uh, stims, key cards, anything I can find, tons and tons of lab stuff, and then level ten, whew, mad money, mad fucking money. That's probably like how those people that have like fifty six mil, they probably go to labs and get all the stuff and then sell it all. Well, I think I told you Willer's E strat that got him, uh, that got him a hundred mil in nine days of the beginning of life. Mm hmm. That, yeah, that he did the, the fucking interchange thing. Yeah. But I think the labs thing is just, like, so much more guaranteed. It's awesome that you can actually be in labs at the beginning of the wipe, sure. But it's it's kind of broken that the realization of being in, in labs at the beginning of the wipe is pretty fucked up. There's nobody there with you. <laughs> yeah, because, I mean, everyone everyone's too scared of it to go in there without being thick. Nobody has a fucking key card, or anybody who does is saving it to sell it on the market. Yeah, that's a good point. Nobody wants to lose a possible 300, 400,000 to, to getting just shit in the labs. And I get it, huge risk, huge reward, but totally worth it in our, in our point. Because I feel like we've played enough Tarkov already that since it's now it's going to be your first wipe and you're going to go back to the beginning, you, you already know, like what we need to do to get money and it's not even that hard yeah especially at the beginning of a wave so if we just focus on our quest grind that out and the second we get a labs key card go in there live or die we will have a good time in there that'd be so fun because once you get in there too you can get more key cards in there like right there's like a ton of spawns in there right there's a ton of spawns for key cards other keys um there's a ton of spawns for meds obviously there's tons of stuff on the raiders grenades meds armor backpacks uh, fucking rigs everything and they all have high tier stuff so if you go in there with bp at the least because I'm, I'm sorry you go in there with ps you're gonna die you're not gonna yeah. go a single raider with ps routes uh, but if you go in there with some bp you're all right gentlemen how we doing Come to Papa. Or pre med. Here's somebody running down there. I got left. We got a sprinter. That's a zoomer. I'm done. How's it get it? I thought I saw a dead body to the left. Somebody might have gotten killed over there. Top of the stairs is clear. That's far side. Just killed a scav. Guy on the stairs. This guy on the stairs. He went down. He's right there on the stairs. We came from. Oh fuck! I just fell. Oh, yeah, I saw. <laughs> oh, I'm going in. Oh, he's in the lockers. I don't know if I hit him or not. Yeah, no, he killed me. I didn't even got hit like him. Got or something. Uh, yep, I'm 6-1. He's not thicked out, though. He's got the SSH helmet. Saw that much. Fuck, there was another guy that shotgunned me. There's two? Yeah, no, there's another guy that came from the other side of the map. Oh, damn. Damn, I hit him, bro. Those rounds are so fucking terrible now. He killed me with flesh. Oh, it's because my armor was broken. 
the guy fucking shredded me with the M16. What ammo does this have? Oh, of course it has PS in it. That's fucking horseshit, man. Why are we Mosin rounds so fucking terrible now? Well, that Not I a single know. point of, of, of armor damage, but I fucking slap that dude in the chest with this shit and he doesn't drop. I can't believe people got so butthurt over Moses last season, man. Like, this is the most gar one of the most garbage guns you can get, and people still got so fucking butthurt that they would be juiced out of their mind and get killed by this by somebody. I mean, it's got one of the best rounds of the game, so... Uh, you ever seen an 8mm Mauser in front of your face? It's a big fucking bullet. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, maybe don't make that a, like start off gun at that point like if people are that upset about it just don't make it a start gun i think what they should do in my opinion is not care yeah it's a fucking moses are you really gonna be mad when grandpappy just... comes to fight you for for his country with, with a fucking world war one gun i mean if you bait the shots and get them to shoot the five times they have to reload i mean it's a if long reload once just what happened to me if they have to put this piece of shit yeah no, people just, I think people just complain a little too much. I'm gonna go with the shitty PPSH, so we'll see how this goes. It's the salt, man. It's that people get so upset that they drop three, four, five mil into their fucking stuff that when I, the guy who didn't even put 100k into my stuff, shoot him in the face, they want to break their entire fucking PC right there and then. Yeah. And I'm sorry, but they're like, that's not my fault. <laughs> that that is literally how I think. Tarkov should be played. I think it's the best thing about this game. That that you can do shit like that. I don't care how juiced you are. If you take a round of the face, you're the same as everybody else, bro. Bull is the great equalizer. Yeah, that's what a lot of people don't understand, though, is that kind of stuff. Prepper, do you sell TTPs? I hit that guy, too. Um, is this a new gun? Or a new round? 760 by 25 TTPT GSH. It is a new round. Okay. I don't know the difference, though. There's two new rounds. If you're looking at TT pistol rounds, uh, the best one's PST GDH. Well, I'm, I'm looking for it for the uh, P90, but... For the P90? SS190? Yeah. Same thing as the... As the 5.7? Uh, no, because the P90 is 762 by 25. The P90 is 762. By 25, yeah. I, I'm sorry, I got a... Huh. I'm I'm about to pull some Among Us shit, and I'm I'm calling an emergency meeting. You're an imposter. That is not true. <laughs> There's no way. A P90 is seven six two by twenty five. Five point seven by twenty eight. You're an imposter. No. Get him out of here. Seven six two by twenty five. I'm, I'm staring at it. F I'm staring at it. Five point seven by twenty eight submachine gun. <laughs> PPSH forty one seven six two by twenty five. I thought you were saying P90. P90. Oh, maybe I did. I was about to throw my whole fucking computer out of this thing was shooting trash fucking TT rounds. That, that, that's very possible that I said that, so I mean, yeah. Yeah, this, this fucking Russian-made World War II gun, hell yeah, this thing shoots the, T, the PST GZH. And you know what I'm going to bring in with it? A big-ass mag magazine. Oh, fuck yeah. Drum bag, you unload that shit into the backpack with a couple of sticks back, uh, back up, you're good. Hey, I've killed sick boys with that gun, man. It's got very little recoil for the amount of rounds it puts out. Can you... Then, can you die before you know it. Can you do anything to this gun? Nothing. Nothing, nothing. It doesn't even chamber around. Oh, uh, that's cool. Okay. All right. I want to break... You have 75 round drums, and that's like your modding for that gun. Oh, my guy is heavily wounded. Yeah, wouldn't you know, some, some magnum buckshot to your knees is not good for you. No? No, that's uh, not something the doctor would recommend. 
What do you mean my character's heavily wounded? I just fixed him. Oh, I got two broken legs. Forgot about that. Sorry, I love the grizzly man that fixes all of that. All of it. Yeah, I'm trying to use up my like half used stuff right now. Like my half used Alea was, my half used CMS is. I've gotten to a point where I just sell them. Yeah. Because I feel the same way as you do. It feels like a waste. But at the same time, I think I've thought about it as I will always forget. And when I don't forget, sure, I'll get rid of them here and there. But it usually takes up more space than it's worth. Yeah. Are we going factory again? Or do you want to go somewhere yep. else? Okay. Yeah. Don't need that buzz and kill. Still need my pack of armor kills. I don't want to bring pack of armor to like freaking shoreline and get chested by one SNB round. Hell no. Especially when I have to buy it. Like it's just stupid. 20k every time, man. And I wish I could say, oh, you know, let's let's just go out the market and buy some. Nobody's selling Packa for less than Ragman that has it, especially brand new. Yeah. And that's stupid. That's so it's easy to find brand new Packa and and everybody wants to sell it for more than Ragman when he sells it right off the bat. That just makes no sense to me. I swear to God, if I get domed right at the start and I can't empty this fucking mag into somebody, I'm gonna be very upset. <laughs> If I can't mag dump this shit, <laughs> please do. Don't, don't don't hesitate to mag dump because if, uh, that's, that's how that thing's used. <laughs> if we spawn in forklifts and there's someone sitting behind that box, that box is gone. Gone. Light it the fuck up. You will hit them. <laughs> oh, by the way, how do you tell if the power's on in? Interchange. Anytime you want to tell if the power is on on any map, as long as the power being on affects one of the X fills being on, you just check your X fills, and uh, the the one that's affected by the power will be green. What about so scav? In, uh, same thing. So an interchange. Um, this also works with scavs. Uh, I think they have the killer X fill. If they don't, then the way you can tell is. There's some lights in the garage that usually aren't on when the power's off. Okay. Uh, but if you're a if you're a scab, it usually doesn't affect you. Oh, another good way is the tech light alarm will be on. So. Oh, okay. You hear the alarm for tech light, or you hear the alarm for Kaiba. That that means the power's on too. Okay. Because I was next to Kaiba and I was like, I don't know if the power's on, but I didn't want to run over there and check. Yep. The only way you can check from Kaiba without the alarm being on if the doors close is you'll see the yellow light inside. Oh, okay. Yeah. St stuff like that, little things like that you'll see on. By the way, do you have the Ollie Logistics Office key? I do. How oh, fantastic. Yeah, I had to buy it for that quest. <laughs> I had the Ollie Office key. I don't know if it's the same thing, though. It's not the Logistics Office key. Nope. The all there, there's two. There's an all the office key that's like just like a manager's office or some shit, and I don't think that one's quest for team. But the the one for all the logistics is the one that you need for the cargo manifest. Yeah, I need that one. Which I got all my manifest stuff done in one game though. I was like, I literally heard two sets of shots. So that was it. That was all there was. I didn't hear anything else on interchange. Oh, you got a rat lobby. Good for yeah. you. Yeah. Sometimes it happens, man. There's a lot of rats active on on interchange, so sometimes you get lucky and you get a rat lobby where everybody you, you matched with just wants to get in there, grab their shit, and get the fuck out and not see a person in their life. Because someone opened the door to the um, office that I was trying to go to. Because I know that door is usually the... One on the right is usually closed, the one on the left is usually open. And so I'm like, okay, someone's been here. I go in there, no one's in there. I was like, all right, cool, get my manifest. I turn around, there's a scav guy, walks in. I shoot him like five times with the AK, semi semi auto has no idea what's going on. Goes, sits in the corner, just starts spraying. And then I just mag dump into him. I was like, what, what, what are you, what? He was terrified, man. He, he thought they were coming from the trees. He had no idea where, where I mean, the fuck you were. I was just standing in like, kind of behind the office, not very, oh. oh. Someone's down there.
I have a Zariah too. Zariah out. Got one. Is there another? I don't know. Back room clear. There's no more down the hall that I see. Ouchie, ouch. I'm still kind of blind though. <laughs> he kind of fucked me up. I don't know what he's using. He's some using something very small. Yeah, uh, he was using the same thing you did. The BPSH. Damn, dude. Did I blow this guy up? Uh, oh, I don't know. I didn't see that guy. Oh, he had an MP9N. I'll take that. Currently, uh, CMSing right now. Oh, he fucked you up? Uh, yeah. He backed up my right arm, but, like, did 15 damage to everything else. What the hell happened to my Tarkov, man? This guy has a pimped out MP13, level 52, magnum buckshot. <laughs> this thing is pimped to the teeth. Got this fucking big ass flashlight on him and shit, PK06. Currently gonna heal all my limbs right now because I'm like half dead. Yep, feeling. You may have killed that guy right there though, because that was like I right. Somebody up. Did, does he have dog tags? Did you check? Uh, I checked the other dude's dog tags. You killed this guy, the yeah. dude with the MP9N. Oh my god, he's thick. I want his stuff. He's thick. I did not blow this guy up. I checked his dog check. Oh, dang. This guy killed him. And there's another... Oh, no, it's not a dead body down the hall. That's, like, trash. Okay, last heal. Oh, he's got... Right. He's got the... That armor. Yeah, he's got Fort Redut. EOD armor. Okay, so we're just gonna get out of here. level boys. Yeah, we're just gonna get out of here. I'm gonna get out of here. I don't give a shit. Don't give a shit what you do, but I'm getting out of here. Just grab his stuff and let's reset. Fucking discard. Thank you. Why was that such an issue? Oh, he's got grenades, dude. The two RGDs and two Vogs. All right. This guy here could have been my last Loza kill if I didn't toss that grenade. Alright. Let's puke out of here. It's fucking mag dumped into that guy. <laughs> Someone's a metal. That ought to scare the shit out of him. Yep. <laughs> well, I heard him on the metal staircase. Headshot. Did 183 damage to his armor. Those guys beef with each other right off the bat. Yeah. I, I gotta be honest with you, I could have sworn the MP9 dude was gonna lose, but that shotgun guy got destroyed. Oh, he probably was rocking AP 6.3. I'll check, but I'm. If he's running that, I think he's gotta be running either SN31 or. Uh, or 7N31, or he's gonna be running AP 6.3. Imagine dying to a guy at pack of armor with the PPSH. <laughs> Alright, what's the verdict? What do we got? Uh, unload the mag. He dumped two mags. He emptied two mags already. What? He's running Luger CCI. Fuck. What are you doing? Luger CCI. Like, why? Yeah, I thought I'm gonna keep this guy shopping. Pretty pimp. I mean, I'm using like shitty guns for um, the pack of armor stuff, so I mean, it's it's kind of worth to keep, honestly. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Shitty guns. You see what this Magnum Bud shot has done to people? <laughs> well, shitty guns, I mean, is like the uh, the what do you call it? Um, like the the MP not the MP5 the MP5s the MP153 and all these like all the crappy guns like I have I have a crappy AKMN I have a PP91 Ketter I have the PPSH like I'm not running heavy stuff oh hell no yeah you know honestly I I haven't tried to run the Mavis stuff in this game but I feel like it wouldn't be fun it's gotta be a like 
10 thou well with you. I, think, I don't think running like meta HKs and shit is fun. Especially since it's dumb expensive. Dummy thick. Oh, no, I don't want to buy a Triton. Hold on. Do not want to buy a Triton. I actually do have this HK. I got off that dude that we thought might have been cheating. So I think I'm going to take this and make it meta. Give it a try. How many rounds do I have in that gun? So I need 40. I need 40 more. Wait, 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 what? What? That was weird. Okay. I put a stack of 40 in there, and it, for some reason, only loaded 20 bullets at a time. I've never seen this MPP V-Rig. That MPP V-Rig is like the the black rock of, of thick dudes. So once we get to that super high-level status of maxed out Ragman, that MPP V and the, the other one... It's like a more reddish version of that one. Uh, it's gonna be like the main vests to use. Let me see what this one has as far as swaps. Yeah, PV, PV. Yeah, it's got a bunch of two slots. So yeah. the difference between this one and the other one is the other one has like uh, a, like two or three four uh, four slot blocks. So that one people use like when they have drum mag and shit. Right. It's a really good rig. It's a really good rig. It's the one you see like Lazarators with and shit. Alright, cool. I'm, uh, I think I'm good. I'm not gonna take all these grenades though. I'm gonna take one more grenade because I would have blown that guy the fuck up if I didn't throw it behind the the forklift. You probably had a better chance too if I didn't flash you. You know, I heard you. Fl I heard you say flash, and I don't know why, but in my head I was like, oh, it's around the corner. I'm good. And fucking, I soaked that Whoa. shit up. I threw it like the back corner by like the back forklift. But I think it hit I the front and ricocheted back towards us. Maybe, but I think what really happened is I was slicing the pie on that corner, and I was so like into the corner already, I could have seen the jackets how close I was to that corner. Oh, okay. So I, I literally basically stared the flashbang in the face. <laughs> well, that's a good pa uh, pack of armor kill. Hell yeah! How many of those do you need? Uh, I need three more. Four more? Five more? I don't know. Let me check real quick. I'm gonna take a couple toms real quick, because this stomach's a little funky. Yo, I always wake up with stomach acid. But it's because I drink a lot of coffee. That's what my doctor told me. Wait, I'm having this pain in like where my stomach is. I mean Tums is like the only thing that really helps. Do you drink a lot of like coffee or orange juice or stuff like that in the morning without eating? Uh G Fuel. Yep, that'll do it, Papa. Anything that's caffeinated, anything that that has like high acidic levels, especially energy drinks and shit like that, they'll give oh. you really high stomach acid content when you're when you uh, wake up in the morning and you don't eat. Uh, Your okay. body will get used to it to some extent, but it's also like a good way to get like an ulcer or kidney stone if you're not careful. That was one of my PMC kills that was flashed, too. Dope. Okay. I actually liked doing that quest. That quest was fun. I'm gonna bring another Zariah just for that. I wouldn't, uh. <laughs> I would go into factory with some, some shotguns or some shit, and take a belt rig and fill it with fucking Sarai's. Oh god. I'm just fucking hucking them down. Everywhere I go, everywhere, every corner I turn, there's a fucking flashbang there. Imagine being like, just sitting there like an office, like just hearing all these Sarai's just go off in the distance, being like, what? What is happening? No, I swear people think they hear that and they, and they think I'm hacking or some shit, that I'm just throwing a ton of flashbangs everywhere. It's not a bad idea, though. <laughs> Alright, now we're on factory. It's Sloan. There's a lot of things you can do in this game just to screw around. Like, I, I, I still have the plan that I'm going to take a backpack, like a, like a tri-zip filled with toilet paper, and maybe put, like, one key card in there or some shit. Like, I'll loot great people. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, you know what? I found it. Yeah, I'm gonna change my my, my gamer tag to Loot Crate and do that. <laughs> yeah, guys, we're the human Loot Crate. Just run over there with no guns, too. Just, like, run in there and stand in front of somebody. Exactly. I'm gonna go into, like, resort. I'm gonna go into fucking resort with nothing and just have my backpack and my fists. Oh, yeah. I had a pistol today, and I went to Shoreline. I was like, you know, I'm just gonna pistol run. Uh, I'll grab the ophthalmoscope, which I grabbed. Um... And these guys are coming out of Cottage. You found a key with tape to get into Sanitar's office? 
No. Uh, you go into the cottage. The cottage. Oh, that's right. And uh, I was going in the cottage, and they were coming out. And they didn't see me, and I popped two shots off. I think I ricocheted off his helmet. And these guys mag-dumped and missed. And I was just sitting in the field, like, spinning, like, hoping they weren't going to kill me. Because I, I had a pistol. Like, I emptied half my mag and didn't kill one. So I was like, I'm, I'm not going to be able to fight this. And they emptied all their mags and finally killed me on, like, the last round of the shotgun guy. And I'm sitting there, I was like, I should have honestly just sat there and fought that, because they were awful. I no. wasn't moving, I was just spinning in the field. So, sometimes, I, I do the same thing, where I just keep trying to dodge bullets like it's the Matrix, and it works, don't get me wrong, sometimes it works. But you're right, you should just try to sit down there and fight it out until you die. There's been so many times, even with the modes in Man, where, where like... I, I, I just go prone, or I just run around a corner really quick, and they're still shooting at me. They're missing horribly, and I shoot them in the face. Because mm -hmm. I feel like in situations like that, when people back dump at the wrong time, and they don't really know what they're shooting at, mm -hmm. they're just spraying bullets in a random direction. So. <laughs> You have like that split second while they're still spraying to shoot them in the face. Oh, he Oh, that spray gets me scared. I started a scab army the other day in Interchange. A like, scab army? Yep. So, I found this guy. And I think he saw, thought I was a bot. I tried to headshot him and miss. And thought he was going to kill me. But he didn't. He just stared at me. So like, okay, cool. So I, I teabagged. He teabagged back. It wasn't a bot because the guy was like actually watching angles. And then we get around to the backside of Ollie. We find a good couple stuff. I like, I teabag and like look at a box and like found some good stuff for him to keep. Because I was like, this guy, this guy is like literally a fucking noob. Like he has no idea what the fuck's going on. Yeah, he's just glad he made a friend that didn't want yeah. to shoot him in the head. And then, well, because we get to the back side where, like, uh, the storage side, and, like, we're outside that door, and a scav pokes his head out. And we sit there, and we both teabag, and then the guy joins us. And we're like, yo, no way this is gonna fucking happen. Like, <laughs> we get, like, three or four more people. They start, like, flaking off um, while they're going to do, like, other stuff. And we so leave. We'll turn into a four stack. <laughs> yep. And we leave, and this guy comes out, this last scav comes out of the trailer out in the thing and domes my scav buddy and I was like no I fucking flanked him and killed him with the um what's it we call it the uh, Mosin that I had right. the betrayal no I was so upset right. it's like the sniper part from saving private riot no yep oh shut the fuck up scav yeah there's a scav at the I haven't seen anybody on the side of the map. He's dead. Bad scab. I'm at the very bottom of the staircase going into office. Alright. Going into the office to get on the second floor. Going into the catwalk to get on the second floor. That's me. Might be somebody on the other side. Someone might be in the office. Someone also might be in the hallway, I can't tell. Nade? Two of them? I fucking dropped onto the goddamn rail and ran right into. Where are you dead? Are you dead? And my mic disconnected. Okay, so I I, I died. He's down the hole. I fucking ran into his grenade. He didn't look too thick, he looked like he had level 4 stuff.
Oh, he got me. He wasn't flashed. What? I threw a flashbang in there and he still fucking killed me. Kill a Kyle. I did 104 damage to his body. He is hurting. Yeah, there's two of them up there. They, they were semi-thick. I was just hoping my mag dump would have fucking killed him. You want to go like interchange shoreline something like that a couple times or go scabby boy because i need stuff i have a ps mag okay i'm getting hungry I guess you're left. Bam. I guess you made it. flashbang and somehow still killed me. Yeah, man, I, I, I don't know what happened, but I fucking... I threw that flat or I uh, threw that grenade, and when he threw his, I tried to, like, jump off the... the, like, middle part of the stairs. Yeah. And it, and it dropped me on top of the rail of the stairs instead. And when I turned around, I ran right into the grenade. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it. Oh, boy. All right, let's set up for another one. Do uh, you want to go? Uh, you want to go, Scabby Boy? You have room? Uh, I have a little bit of room. Yeah, I think we can do that. Now, I just think, do you want to try to go Scabby Boy or Reserve? Uh, you know what? That usually is incredibly intimidating to me. I'm actually pretty about that. Because I need those 50 cal shells as well as that military battery. I need those things too. Okay. And I half know my way around Reserve. I don't want to fucking tell you something that's that's a lie but i kind of know this place a little bit i don't i sit there on my map half the time so yeah that's probably gonna happen even with me here so uh um I'll, actually I'll, I'll do what i can uh time zones are kind of shit let's go to the factory one more time yeah go. because right now it's sitting at uh five o'clock <laughs> no yeah that's perfectly fine i was gonna set up anyways just so i had more room i'm gonna bring Pack of armor and my 6B47 helmet one more time. Oh, fuck. Uh, okay, let's do this. Let's do the old switcheroo thing going. That goes there, that goes there, that goes there, that goes off, that comes off. I'm not bringing a backpack in the factory. We're just gonna bring PS rounds, because fuck it, why not? Hey, bro, there's been a lot of times we've hopped into factory so far, and there's guys with just no armor. <laughs> so. Yeah, I mean, I, I would say nine times out of ten, four out of the five people probably don't have armor. Probably, right? That or they're all thick. They're all there for beef. How are you going to nerf Mosin rounds and then also make them way more expensive than they used to be? Like, come on, man. Okay, like, do the one, one or the other, please. Yeah, you gotta do both. These rounds aren't as good, and you made them way more expensive than they were last time. When I was buying LPS GCH from Prapper before, it was like fucking 50 rubles a round. Now it's like 400 from him. If I ever buy it on the market, it's like 250. Is this mag? Oh, this is 7.62 by 39. How much? Oh, that's BP rounds. Okay, hold on. I do have mag of BP. Put that in there. 
I was bringing two, two spare mags. for one more factory run and then we'll go scale. Fuck. I just healed up. Oh, I am not healed. Thank God. Thank God there's that giant red flag. For real. There'd be plenty of times my ass would be grass with a uh, little flag. I gotta buy another Zariah. Can only buy 10 Zariahs at a time, really? That's, tra that's kind of trash, let's be honest. Yeah, I, I don't know why they would have a cap on Zariahs, especially if they have a quest specifically for it. They shouldn't have a cap on Zariah's or RGD vibes. I have no idea why they did that. I mean, again, someone running with a belt rig, I can see it. But are grenades really that OP, man? I understand people getting annoyed, like, oh my god, this guy won't stop throwing grenades, but leave. It's not like they're doing anything, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so, I mean... Those people that I run into that just keep hucking grenades, like, I just sit there and, like, hunker down and, like, make sure I'm not in the room. Exactly. No, I just let them waste every cent of that, of that ten grand per grenade they've spent. Sometimes then, they're bringing bogs and doing that shit. Yeah. Some people just don't understand. Some people just don't care. They'd rather get the free kill with the grenade and not have to beef, you, uh, beef with you. True. And if they dump every single grenade to do that, they don't care. That's a good point, yeah. It's like low tier skill. <laughs> low tier meta. Like that that person who literally just like hucked like seven grenades in the cottage one day when I was in there. I was like, all right, yeah, I'll just keep switching rooms so I'm outside the blast radius. Oh yeah, and he can know you that you're in there all he wants. He's still got to go in there and do something about it. Yeah, he's still got to go in and check the body. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna grab a snack real quick. Get me some hungry. Take us so along the match on the factory. What the fuck? I really need to make a sandwich after this game. Valley, man. Hey, they make some great stuff, bro. I, I used to like getting those, uh, those granola bars they have, and they, they had these peanut butter ones at the, the Walmart I went to, and that was just great. I'm having this, one of those sweet and salty ones. Mm. Okay. Let's get it. Instead of shooting me, gotta love scabs.
Immediate hallway is clear. There was shooting on the other side though, so I don't know where they are. Talk grenade over there. He's over there. He's dead. Ah! Office clear. Where was Paracord? Is it the Paracord? Put that on my butt. Box ram on the shelf here. Why are people ratting on factory? What is this? I, I, I don't know, these guys are weird. There's nothing in here, so I don't know why the fuck they do that. You good? Yeah, that's a scabby boy. He's very, very hurt. I heard some sprinting away. Was that it? Probably. I'm looking back. Bye, yeah. bitch. You good? I domed the guy. I domed this guy. He's thick. I don't know if he's by himself. He came from the uh, the catwalk that we came from. You good? Yeah, where did he go? He he's on the side that we came from. I'm watching his body. He's dead. I fucking domed piece his ass. Alright, I'm going through the bathroom right now. Alright, I'm going back to our side. I don't hear anything. Back on the side that we came from. Okay. Looks like we're good. I think he was by himself. I'm looting him. Level 50 with an SR-25. Beta 2. Is that you next to me? Yeah. Okay, I thought I was dead. Appreciate you, Papa. All the grenades. Thank you. Fuck. Why are you so trashed? Kiddo, why are you so trash? Ooh, and you had a... What is this? I had a Stalate Web for me. Man, he must be uh, pretty mad about that. That's fine. I'll take it. What you got in the mag, Bubba? M61. Yeah, buddy, pretty pissed. I'd be pretty pissed. Anything left on him that you don't want? Uh, Tarzan rig, some... Some uh, helmet or some shit. I have no idea what's in this backpack, so... And now I don't need Mosin kills, so thanks for the... for the new gear. It's high level 2. Level 50. Montavo. Alright, well, you're right. Yep. Man, if he wasn't throwing that grenade, he probably would've destroyed me. I just had that split second when he tossed a grenade to have a chance to shoot him in the head. And luckily I didn't miss. I do have my factory key on me, so it doesn't matter where we go. Alright, let's go to this one right here. Do that. Okay. closest. I don't hear anything. Clear. Oh, the rip. store is unlocked. Is this gate three? Yeah, it's gate three. Okay. Good. Get a beta two. He, he had less armor than I did. He had a level 3 crappy armor with M61 in this, in this friggin' SR25. <laughs> hey, you got a free SR25 out of it, though. Oh, yeah. That stuff on it, too. Hey, I'm gonna use this fucking thing. I didn't even think I domed him. I thought I just took a quick, like, quick peek at him. And and he fucking flopped over and air <laughs> through the thing. <laughs> No, 7.62 full auto actually isn't that bad. Bro, you can do minimal stuff to it, and it's pretty doable. And if you made it out, and a made it out 7.62 gun has very little recoil. You can control it, and it has BP, you know? Yeah, you really fuck people up like that. Theta 2 max. That's why we put it in my stash first. And we put my beta inside of it, and now we have another beta. Now I can sell my paracord. Stacking up those betas. 29k? Fuck yeah. 
one mag of M61 and the rest is M80. Why do you do this to me? See, I don't see the point of bringing more than two mags of good ammo. Because afterwards it's all scabs. <laughs> Feel that? What I do is I just bring less mags and bring the bullets in my gamma. Hmm. So I'll bring like... Like if, if I brought this dude's SR-25, I would take it with one, maybe two extra mags and just bring uh, M61 in my in my gamma. But I wouldn't load this shit with M80. I have no idea why they do that. This is pretty pimped out. This is a pretty meta uh, SR-25. I can only do some more, a little bit more shit to it to make it a little bit better. And it's actually a surprisingly short gun. It's weird. I didn't think it'd be this short. I gotta see where I'm gonna make space for that. I don't need my bows and kills anymore. I don't with that, thank god. Where do you want to go? That's what I'm thinking about. Because I just finished this quest, so. I don't know. Where do you want to go? I mean, I know you wanted to do a scabby run, right? Oh, true, yeah. Let me make a little bit of room. to sell the crappy guns I just got. PP91 on a Sega. Yeah, we have a little bit of room. Okay, so we'll do the scav run on reserve, I guess. Mm -hmm. I'll just have this AK in my fucking... Already. My inventory's kind of fucked right now. So this is, uh, I just got like the first part of the sniper thing that you have to level up your sniper skill. Oh. Uh, this one's still level four, so you just have to get your first one level four. I think after that though, it's gonna get worse. My uh, sniper's level three right now. Recoil pad for aim sports mosin rifle. We'll actually use this. Okay, I'm gonna. Okay, I made a little bit more room for stuff. All right, now I'm good. Scabby boy, reserve 649. I'm gonna AKS 74U. And then in the meantime, once we queue up, I'll make another sandwich because I am fucking dying right now. Cool. A uh, show. I usually reserve. make my sandwiches before. Yeah, reserve 652. Uh, usually do that before uh, before streaming. Yeah, I usually, well, I usually make, like, a sandwich so I can just, like, quickly, like, go grab it and bring it back. But I forgot to do that this morning. Oh, that's right. I have my moat, uh, or my sniper scav. So that's a pretty good scav to have for reserve. I have the AKS-74U. I have the M700, and Ooh. if I have M61 in it, it should be good. I usually get this gun with M61, M62. I think I have a Birkin bag, which is dope, because that if we find that military barrier, that thing's like a 2x4, so. Yeah. I, I have a, a duffel bag, so I think it'll just barely fit, fit it. Uh, yeah, duffel bag will. Uh, army bag will. Army bag's the smallest bag that'll take it. Okay. Alright, I'm going to queue us on my own sandwich.
Cool. <laughs> hey, do you understand financial aid by any chance? Kind of, why? I'm having an issue with these people where I, I signed up for any financial aid, I got it, I was approved, they awarded me some money, but now I can't figure out how the money thing works. What do I, what do I do? Do I collect it? So, <coughs> it's not like a financial aid where they put it into your bank account, right? I, I don't know. That's the thing. Okay. Because usually what happens is you apply for financial aid. And my school had a portal where you went into and went in and put in your financial aid for the year. What you might have to do is call the financial aid office and be like, hey, I have X amount of dollars coming in for financial aid. Um, and they should be able to tell you, they, they there may be an online website where you go in and do it, which is where I did mine. But there may not be. I mean, I, I did set up something with them because they have like a bank service that handles refunds and, and I guess the disbursement of, of funds. And I logged into that portal for the for the bank that does it for them. And that uh, payment history hasn't updated because I got the email today from financial aid that they awarded me that money. Um, but the, the portal from the bank hasn't updated. It doesn't say that I have any new awards or new money that I'm supposed to collect. So I, I don't know if it takes time because I was reading that apparently the portal says that uh, it needs to receive the information from financial aid first. They receive the money and then I get it. Yeah. Out? Okay. So it might be that since I got it today, I have to wait for them to get the money kind of thing? Yep. <laughs> okay. My school did it every Wednesday. So they probably have a day in the week where they do it every single day of the week. All right, back out. They have a day where they do it every day of the week? Yeah. I'm backing out. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I backed up. How long did you have to wait for your reserve one last time? When I got in? Like, a minute. I'm just so used to the, the old lobby queues of like 30 minutes that I'm thinking to myself, oh, we just, we just have to wait here. <laughs> yeah, no. There's no choice. Well, because there have been times in Shoreline where we would back out and then immediately get in the game the second we got in the lobby again. Yeah. Bastard. All right. Like, like Austin Powers, big fat bastard. That's what I was thinking of. In your breaky. <laughs> Clap trap force. <laughs> I'll clap your trap. <laughs> or I'll trap your oh clap. Come on, just put us into a game. Let's see if we get luckier. Put us in a game. Put us in a game. Put us in a game. Come on. 
Come on, come on. <clears throat> I just want the stupid task done with. Because I know you can get anything any like in customs, like in the factory area, but it's way lower spawn. Way oh, lower. Like, like stupid lower. Yeah, fuck that. We'd have to do so many factory runs and <clears throat> look everywhere for it too. Forget that. And possibly get maybe two rounds. Because that's what Frenchie got when he found him. If it doesn't work this time, I'll just go interchange. Do do OFZs the military batteries spawn on on interchange? Not that I've seen. I've seen that. Um, so the military batteries can spawn on any tank, uh, like on the back of it or on the base of the treads. Um, the the fifty cal rounds um, spawn in. Reserve the most common. Um, so far, I've seen nowhere else. Is what the wiki says. I know that you have a very slight chance of spawning with one on your scav already. Yeah. That's how I got one. Um, but besides that, I, I personally never seen it spawn. In the world. I think reserves the only chance we have. <laughs> And I, I mean, it's not bad reserve, uh, scavenging on reserve. At least like this, we can try to learn the map. Yeah. Again, I don't really know it that well. Because <laughs> the thing is that, that I always get to with online, I can learn the map, but only to a certain extent, man. I know where to go, but I don't know where people are. I know yeah. people chill in the dome. I know people chill where there's like raiders and stuff. But I don't know like the, the spots where people chill. Yeah. Don't know the high traffic areas. Exactly, and it's like once you, once you learn the flow of the map, I feel like that's that's really when you learn the map. But you have to do that in online, right? Because like shoreline, it's like we know the trails because between resort and cottages is very high traffic. Between resort and cell tower is super high traffic because of the two exfils. Like, right. But would you let's say sweat your balls off going from cottages to villages uh, near the end game? Not really. No. Most people are gone 30 minutes in, so... But, if we don't know, we wouldn't think that, and, th and then we're in that fucking grass, slow walking for 20 minutes to our exfil because we're, we're hoping not to get shot in the face. Mm -hmm. And then we speed walk around resort because we think it's okay. Yep. That's pretty much what we're going to with reserve. I, I know that a lot of people have callouts for the buildings by the the marks on the side of them: white pawn, black pawn, mm -hmm. uh, white knight, black knight. But I, I still can't tell which buildings which from the outside. I know the three building, the three buildings by the helicopter and the one to the left of it, just because right next to that street is where you press the button for the hermetic door, and uh, that's the one exfil I I know for certain I can get out with that armored train. Um, the pawns and stuff are painted on the side of the buildings. I, I, I know they're painting it on the side, but if I don't see it, I don't know which building's which. You get me? Oh, same. I mean, I was on reserve for the first time today. Oh, so this scav raid you did on reserve was your first time? Mm hmm Well, uh, I definitely recommend getting some offline run-ins in, at least so you can kind of see what the map looks like and where you can go. It's vast, man, because the thing about Reserve is it's huge, and there's so much stacked loot. There's, like, buildings that are three stories, there's the underground area, which is also deep and, and completely complicated. I get lost down there all the time. Uh, I mean, it's a huge map with a ton of loot. You just kind of got to learn where everybody is, because if you don't know, you die so fast on this map, since everybody's sniping. Yeah. When you get into the underground, though, it's super CQB in the underground. Super, super close quarters fighting. I like that. There's raiders down there, too. That's why I'm excited for Streets of Tarkov, because it's, like, all urban. I'm excited, but I'm also a little a little uh, intimidated. Oh, yeah. Because it, it's either going to be one of two things. It's either going to be a... It's either going to be a, a map filled with factory, and then very little spots of like woods and, and shoreline those long range engagements or it's gonna be like dorms everywhere 
and it's gonna be a custom style map just dorms everywhere my guess is it'll be like a dorms resort kind of mix with a little bit of reserve buildings and you'll pretty much get your long street fights but for the most part like it's gonna be close quarters it's gonna be tight with yeah. the tight alleyways and there's going to be long, long streets of, of openness, I bet. Yeah. At least from what we saw from the walkthrough, it definitely looks like there's going to be plenty of places to snipe from. But those tight those tight alleys and once you're inside the buildings, which are huge, tons of floors, I I think it's going to get really tight in there. We're in. What I'm curious of, though, is how much time, how many people, how many exfils. Yeah. Because I swear to God, if they do the same fucking thing where there's only, like, one exfil each side of the map, I'm going to fucking scream. I don't know what the hell is wrong with Nikita. That's what I hate with, like, woods. Um, interchange. I was like, there's, like, two or three main exfils, and that's it. This is bullshit. Like, come on, man. Is there, does it really make the game that much easier to give me more exfils? Like, come on. Oh, and I, I also heard from Nikita's most recent post, uh, podcast that he did in Russian. Okay. Uh, the newest expansion is going to be Woods. Oh, really? Yep, that's the next map they're going to expand. They're going to expand it two times the size of the map. What? Out where they have Sniper Rock is. Okay, so we're going to go left. We're going to go right. I think he's in the train yard. So we're gonna go left? Yeah. There's a wall here. Where do we go? Um, oh, shit. Hold, hold, hold on a second here. I spawned with a bunch of good stuff. Oh, crap. What'd you spawn with? Uh, well, I have a flash drive, uh, grenade, propadol, a knife pack. Okay, I'm going over the pipe, and I'm running down. Let's go. Yay. If you start getting shot at, just go prone. I'm gonna check this tank for the military battery. Yeet! Bullets. Nothing. Watch out for the dome! Bullets. Fuck! Wait, is that it? I don't see anybody at dome! But this is terrifying! Just follow me. What's this? Just so you know, this road to our right <laughs> is where the hermetic bunker door gets pushed. That building to our left, I know people chill in there. Alright. I'm going to this building like right next to us. I'm in. Oh, they are killing each other in there. This is so stressful. I'm in here too. Okay. Pomegranate sure. juice. milk. There's 762 PS there. Oh, yeah. And uh, M855 there. Alright. Come on, battery, 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 battery. Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. Nope. Hurry up. We're gonna get you. Shots! Man, where did all that fighting go? Right I just want to know where he is. I might not even shoot him. I just want to know where he is. What do I got? Uh, AKMN. Cool. Just pick one of those up. Yeah, nearly full PS. Okay. Hi. Oh, there's a turret right here. There's also a bunker to our right. I don't know if you care about that. MGL turret. Let's check out the bunker. It's usually got loot. 
Oh, there's another tank in here. Let's see if there's a car battery or a military battery. I see nothing. I see nothing. Even any loot in here? Like anything at all? Oh, there's like nothing in here. Okay. Noted. Bunkers, not worth our time. Okay. Another tank over here. Nothing. God damn it. A lot of tanks, no military batteries, huh? That bunker is closed. We're gonna go to the underground bunker here. The underground building. What's that? Safe? This yep. is another hot spot where we're going. This is where I was last time. So I found a lot of good shit in here. Tool set, uh, take it. Duct tape, screwdriver, hit double A battery. Okay, we got 27 minutes left pretty much. Chilling. It's me on wood. We got magazine, dust cover, suppressor. Also break. Everything I'm looting is empty. Jesus. Wait, I thought I picked up a magazine. Oh, I did. Okay. Metal scissors. Nice. Okay, uh, we're gonna go back onto the big room that we were in. There's a big crate right here you can loot. This one right here. Okay. I'll grab the next one. I didn't know you could loot these. Yeah. Ration supply crate. Also, this has food in it. And two packs of more world cigarettes. Okay. Oh, it's the second time I've had Alianka in this fucking box. Hey, the Alianks. Okay, uh, we're gonna put that up there. We're gonna put this in here. That's all I care about that. Oh, staircase there. Right. This is where things get a little fuzzy for me. I have no idea where we are now. Um, I usually just loot these next couple rooms and then dip out. Okay, as long as you know where to dip out and you know where we're going, I'll, I'll follow. Not An a problem. NRG drink. There's pomegranate juice in here if you need the liquids. Ooh, another big chest. I, didn't I, see have, this so last time. I, I have so many juices. Like, it's, it's absurd. So there's pineapple juice. Is filled with juice. So many juices. Uh, we'll get rid of that. We'll get pineapple juice to Shanka. I thought we came to reserve to find military stuff. I didn't know they drank so much juice. Um, I have. Three pineapple juices, one palm juice, two pineapple juices, an energy drink, Tashanka, condensed milk, and Alianka. Jesus. People gotta eat. Yes rounds. Okay, I didn't find wiper there. Let me know if you find a small WD-40. Okay. The last thing I need for that quest. If we get lost, it's not my fault. You got the map. You're the guide. You're the Sherpa. Oh, thank God the rain's gone. I know we have to come down here for a proper quest. Scary. Let me take it down, uh, look down the hall with my sniper scope. Are you full? 
Yeah. There's oh. raiders down here, so we gotta be careful down here. Yeah, fuck this. These guys won't fuck around, so. Alright. Let's get out of here. They can live their little mole rat life. This is the classroom? Oh, this is the classroom, okay. What's in here? Got a bag? Were we just in here? Uh. No. We were in that room, yeah, to the left. Ooh, more condensed milk. Let's go. Another pomegranate. That's great. Pomegranate juice here, man. Whoa, Pineapple juice. <laughs> Saga 9, and what's this? A door I can't open. Oh, it's a block stock. How about that door to the right down the hall, the very end? PST, GZH, alright. Uh, another pineapple juice, thank you very much. We'll drink it. Pack of nails. PRS. Sugar! Sugar! Um, I accidentally clicked, clicked to use all on a sugar the other day. Ooh, that probably dehydrated the doo doo out of you, too. Yep. <laughs> That's fucked up. Alright. Alright, now what? How do we get out of here? Um, this way. This way. I'm gonna sit in this room while I navigate real quick. Yep. All right, what do we have for X-fills? We don't have heating pipe. Uh, I got bunker hermetic, scab land, sewer manhole, home fence by the mountains, CP fence, and armor train. I know where armor train is, and hermetic, uh, hermetic bunker door. Where's CP fence? Oh, that's kind of close to here. You want to go CP? I think so. Wait, I don't know which map, which... Is that CP fence or is it CP fence? I'm confused. These maps are awful. That's CP fence. Do we have hole in fence? Uh... Hole in fence by mountains? Yes, we do have that. Okay. Oh, apparently the train's here, too. What's the train? The Arbor train. Like, kind of close to where we spawn. We'll go wherever you think. Just go to the hole in the fence. Or whichever closest. Yeah, I, think, I think that's over here. I think it's that light right there. I think. I was wondering what that fucking light was for. I figured it might be for an exfil, but I, I didn't want to run over there and find out. Well, looks like what we're doing. That is what we oh, are. Oh, we're up exfilling. Are you exfilling? Yes, I am. There's yes. a giant dome, though, that I literally just saw, and I'm kind of terrified. Okay, I'm going to lay down. I don't think he can see us I'm out. here, because we're, like, behind two trees. I'm out, too. Okay, okay. Reserve, very nice, with a three alley on gun one day. But not a military battery in sight. Or bullet. Or bullet. Well. I did get two condensed milk, sugar, and Alianca, though. And a pack of nails. I did get BS rounds, too. Cool set. Uh, that was a pretty good raid. Money there. We got a suppressor for something. I don't know what it's for. And a whole shit ton of juice that I don't have room for. Cool. <laughs> well, that's how I'm feeling about this right now. I'm probably going to sell a lot of it. Yep. I have a backpack filled to the brim with juice. <laughs> and Tashankas and, and Humpback and... Oh my god. We got food and drink for days. 
No, it's PRS rounds. Those are gross. Get out of here. Nobody likes your kind. Bird. Okay, I have no place to put this stuff. Sell the pineapple juices that go for the most. Oh, they do. A lot of all these foods I had besides the Tashanka. Actually, pineapple juice is not that expensive. It's only 8,500 right now. Versus the other food I have. I know humpback and herring aren't worth shit. These might be worth something. What's the Tashanka worth? Oh, the Tashanka's worth 13k, so I'm gonna sell that. Uh, squash is usually pretty expensive. I did not get that. I wish. When I get squash, I saw that shit. Cause you're right. It's expensive. It's like 17k right now. Wait, do I need flash drives to upgrade my Intel Center? Yes, you need three. To uh, to get it to level two, right? Yeah. Nails still going for 35k right now. Oh boy. Oh daddy. Packer nails are fucking expensive. Pack o nails. Pack o nails. So we're gonna sell this. Slide off this and sell that. Actually, no, I don't want to sell this one. This one's a shitty ammo. Right? sell these two guns. K, 34K. Oh, okay. I sold everything. Oh, uh, yeah. Made about almost 200K with that. Pretty good. Dope. All right. What's next? And I kept a bunch of shit. Uh, what is next indeed? Well, I need to go to interchange, I need to go to reserve, I need to go to... What else I need to go to? Um... 
a lot of these are just fucking finding items. I mean, I gotta do shit and, uh... Oh my god. Interchange too. What do you need to do? I have, a, I have a stupid annoying quest that I have to do. Check this out. It's called Hot Delivery. I have to stash two uh, Comtac headphones in a specified place. I have to stash a 6B47 helmet in a specified place, but it gets better. I have to stash a Gazelle armor in a specified place. Two of them. Are those expensive? They're level 5 uh, ceramic armors, so yeah. <laughs> Fucking Solid. 200k. Fuck that. I wouldn't even do that one. I really don't want to, but you know, what are you supposed to do? <laughs> I'm not gonna do it right now, though. Uh, I have to get the clothes design handbooks, which is just, I, I kinda know where those are. They're in these bookstores. Uh, let me take a look. Yeah. How much is a key with tape going for right now? Oh, I wouldn't be too surprised. Probably dummy expensive. Hold on. No. 264k. Hmm. Don't tell me you're thinking about buying one. Well, I need to go to Sanitar's office. I, I, I'm going to be completely honest with you. I got lucky and found one pretty easily. It was on a dead Scav's body. Scavs on Shoreline have a very, very uh, small chance of spawning it. So. Do you still have it? No, I sold it. I sold it for like 5 mil. <laughs> it was still on, I, I sold it when it was still that time period that nobody was selling one. So you could sell it for whatever price you wanted, and somebody was gonna buy it. 500k right now. Oh, I know my prices are fucked up. Hold on. 266k. Because here's the thing if I do that, I get a graphics card. The graphics okay. card completes. Farming part four. Oh, I got gun part, gunsmith part sixteen now. Oh shit. Twenty-eight thousand XP. Oh boy. Okay, so. Let's see where we're at. Also need kills in dorms. I need to go to reserve. Okay, one of the stores is pretty close to Idea on the first floor. And then one's on the second floor. Okay. On the, on the like, Ollie side, it looks like. Yeah. It's closer to the Ollie side. So you want to run in uh. and real quick? Yeah, we'll do it. Let me just uh, prep up here. In case we run into thick boys, I'll take one mag of VP for the AKM. Two sets of metal scissors. Which means I can make two mag cases. Gotcha. I just need the fuel cans to be empty. I 
now one of them is empty. I also need another water filter. Well, we should be able to get a lot of that stuff on it. Yeah. Thought I had okay. extra PS rounds. Now I'm gonna buy PS. Oh, I got the thick weapons case fucking quest from Prapper now. Okay. Uh, I have that one too. Which which one's that? You need to get level four standing with everybody. That's it. No, oh, I just need level four standing with Ragman, Mechanic, and Peacekeeper. There's someone else I have that has a thick weapons case too. Or Ragman, Mechanic. Uh, yeah, Ragman. Oh, the three Ledex and three Ophthalmoscopes. You get a thick items case too. Well, this one's a thick weapons case. Oh, okay. That, that was a thick case. Oh, I got another mission. Oh, okay. Oh, I got that one, too. I reached uh, level 4 with Manic Mechanic and one level 4 with uh, Ragman. Okay, so I need Mechanic, Ragman, and Peacekeeper. What does Peacekeeper need? He needs money and rep. And I already have his level. Mechanic I needs need... to be level 40. Ragman needs to be level 40. So what I need to do is Peacekeeper shits. I need to find that WD-40, which we will probably find it here. And I need to plant all the beacons on the ritual spots. I haven't done that yet. I right, alkalized surface, surface washer and two propane tanks. I also, I need to get the intel level too, so I can make this stuff for this quest. What else do I need? Med station needs to be level three. Fuck me, dude. I did that, and it was a pain in the ass. Totally worth it, man. Did you that's just buy the stuff? Yeah. I, I literally just worked up the money. It took me like a day or two to work up the money and still have something afterwards. I had like 1.7 mil at the start of it. And by the time I was done, I was down to like 600k. Well, I just bought both of the thing. <laughs> Fucking hate my life. I, I know it hurts. I know it hurts looking at that number drop so drastically, but... Oh. It comes back. It comes back. It probably comes back. Okay, med station's being upgraded. <sighs> Fuck me. And for this, I need four hard drives, four power cords, and three intel. What's that mission for the intel? To give you intel? Yeah. I really don't know. It sounds like something mechanic. Not mechanic, nope. Just check that one. Grabber? Mm. Nope. Oh, uh, I'm gonna bring my camera just in case Kaiba's open. Oh, you know what? No, no, that's the Doc's case. That's, uh, nostalgia. Yeah, it's, um, kill seven PMCs in dorms with free Jaeger. Oh, you know what? I probably have to do nostalgia and shit first, if I don't have that yet. <clears throat> yeah, that gives me 20,000 XP. Two Intel folders, two flash drives. Yeah, man, you need to do quests at this higher level. Taking me forever to get out of level 35. Slap 79,000. I still need to do the uh, Tarkov shooter one. The, uh, the Mosin boy. ones. You still need like three more kills, right? Yep. Oh boy. I think I, I think what might happen is we might have to run a pistol run to uh, Shoreline. I might just end up buying the fucking key and just yeeting in there. For the, oh my god, for the Sanitar quest? Yeah. Uh, okay. I mean, if you want to do that, I guess we can. I mean, I want to go interchange first, because that stuff's easy. All right. Or easier, I should say. Yeah, we just have to get in there and grab something at least. 
I also don't know if I can take everything off my person right now. <laughs> that's wow, the I... other situation. Ah, okay. <laughs> so that's gonna go in there. Uh, I need a full fresh Salewa. Uh, you had the, lo the Logi key, right? Oh, thank you for reminding me to bring that, because I wouldn't have brought it. Yeah, I don't have too many interchange keys, I only have a couple, but I'm still gonna bring my dog's case. Is in one of these TV rigs. Promise this in one of them. Probably. I should have thought Did I lose my dog's case now? Yeah, this is what happens when you get to a point that you can't control your stash. I need to organize this. Oh, here it is. It was just out in my face. I didn't notice. Yeah, next season I am definitely going to uh, focus more on organization. Yeah, and I'm going to be getting into darkness, which is not happen anymore. Oh, it still happens. Don't get me wrong, it still happens. Maybe if I organize, that's the way I try to think about it. Maybe if I just organize. Yeah, what I might do if we go shoreline, I'll just bring my crappy MPX, not my metal one, and just eat in. I'll throw some like AP 6.3 or Luger CCI in it. Something that's not the greatest, but something that's, that'll still do damage. Feel that. And like, sure. I'll bring like three grenades so I can just dump grenades down the hallway if need be, and then dip out. Because I'm assuming it's going to tell me to get in there and then tell me to find an item. 100%. It's not going to tell me just to fucking go in there and get out. It's, it's possible it might, but fuck. <laughs> Okay, I think I am good. Oh look, my scav's back up. <laughs> nice. Okay, PMC. Interchange. 1225. Oh, and if we do any uh, reserve raids PMC, please remind me to take uh, the marker key to have that. Oh yeah, I have, the, I have a bunch of keys for um, reserve. I have the bloody key. I have the one of the VP, VSO or v, VTO or something like that key. All right, I'm bringing two grenades. TTV Dave. Dave. TTV Bex the Kitty. Kill inside of you. Sticks. The real Merrick. Damn it, Damn Bobby. It, Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, Bobby. Chief Wiggums. Death Lord. Hemorrhoid. Same, though. <laughs> tiger, tiger, tiger. The crossbow. Let me know when you show blue. Yep, I'm here. I was watching some more of the YouTube rants that they do on Tarkov, man, and it's like, anybody that reaches level 40 is already endgame, apparently, and I, I I guess there's quests to do, but I'm kind of concerned about that. I never really thought about that, but it's true. Once you get to level 40, all your traders can be maxed out, and now what? You just, just kill people, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you could, like, still farm money and, like, go to labs a lot rather than just the normal places. I mean, yeah. Actually, I use your thick boy stuff thick boy. because it doesn't matter at that point. Yeah, because you can just buy all that thick boy shit. Yeah. And and for a much cheaper price because you get it from the traders instead of having to buy it on the expensive ass market.
mean, I'm not really too concerned about it right now, because obviously I still got a long ways to go before that happens, but... I mean, we're also going to have Streets of Tarkov stuff, too, next season. Yeah, but I saw the, like I said, I saw that podcast that Nikita was doing, and he said that's not even something that's going to happen this year. Oh, wow. Yep. He, he has no no intentions of releasing Streets of Tarkov or any of that this year. The the, the new armor system or any of that. But he did a new explain armor a system? He did explain a bit about the new armor system and what's going to happen is he wants it to be more realistic in the sense that there's plate carriers and pouches and shit that you can customize on your plate carrier. Oh. And um, you actually have armor plates. So the the armor level will depend on the plate that you have, not on the carrier. Uh, that's awesome. And it's not going to be like bubbles or protection anymore. Now the plate's going to be where you're protected. Yeah. So you can shoot. You can you can have a dude that has like level six armor and shoot him in the fucking armpit. You know, and he'll die. It'll go right through his armpit. He'll... I bet that'll that'll release the game right there. I I think they're like getting ready to because they're doing so many hot patches and bug fixes right now. They talked about that too. They said they want to release the game just as bad as anybody else, but that they want things to be like finalized and perfect. They didn't say for sure that the next wipe would be the last one or the next patch would be the last one and actually release the game. But they just said adamantly how much they want this game to be finished already. Yeah. So, um, I think they're just taking their time with the newest patch. They did say that uh, 12.8 is supposed to be the quality of life patch, and yeah. that one should be coming soon. No wipe. That's going to include a bunch of shit like they're going to add the compass, they're going to do a bunch of user interface changes and shit like that. And, uh... We late spawned by like four minutes! Are you serious? Hey, yep. <laughs> I'm still awaiting session start. I'm fucking here, mate. I might disconnect then. I might just close my app and reopen it. Hi, hi, bye, bye. Give it a second, give it a second. You're loading loot? No, I'm awaiting session start right now. Give it a second, give it a second. I've been awaiting session start for 3 minutes and 30 seconds. Yeah, I'm DCing. Fuck. Terrified right now. I try to hide in a bush. I haven't seen anyone like spawn rush interchange before. They usually just run to interchange. They don't spawn rush, yeah, but I already heard fighting. Like, the second I spawned, I heard fighting, and it's like, oh, yeah, late raid. Ah. <sighs> oh, I'm just prone in a bush waiting. All right, we're starting game right now. See how this goes. Man, I still hear people shooting. I think that's in the garage. Well, the more that they kill each other, the, the less people that'll be. Also, the less people to open Kaiba, though. Yep. I didn't bring the camera, did you? Yep. Oh, wow. I always bring the camera just in case I'm able to wrap my way, wrap my way into Kaiba. Yeah. I feel that. I, I just don't have a fucking camera. I don't got space for all that. Yeah. Oh, and something uh, new they said with that uh, podcast is they're trying to release a new uh, pouch specifically for meds. So there's going to oh, be nice. a container specifically for meds. They don't know if it's going to be like a, a one by one to like two by six, but they're gonna. It's going to be specifically for meds. So that's all it'll take. A customizable bag would be cool too. You know, like a like a moly bag that you could take pocket 
pouches off and put pouch, pouches on. Yeah. Because then you could put like you you might be able to put on like a, a two by two pouch that maybe does two two by three, and that that'll be like just for meds, or you can do like one for just for like valuables or something like that. That'd be kind of cool. Well, I think once they do the the new armor system that they want, they're gonna they're gonna add shit like uh, the pouches for the vests and the plate carriers. And when they do that, they'll probably do like what you're talking about: specific pouches for meds, specific pouches for grenades and, and ammo and such. You know. Okay, man. All right, I'm in this bush. I'm gonna stand up. Fuck am I? Just in the middle of nowhere. What's up? Find you. Okay, well, eight minutes late. All right, let's see how this goes. A lot of guys killing each other in the, in the garage in front of us. I think it's the Ollie garage. Or the idea garage. Ideas far left. So this is the Ollie garage. Okay. No, this is idea. Right. All right, right in front of us. The hatchling, I killed him. What you got in your bag, big boy? Oh, hello there, papa. What we got here? Two fuel canisters, some tubes. Uh, third fuel can. You want some fuel, Mumbles? Have some fuel. There you go. What? You. What do you mean he's got this much fuel? What the fuck? How did this guy get all this shit and he's already out? Oh, he probably just ran down the road by the uh, military trucks. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate you. Take his backpack. I wasted my BP on you, and I'm not really happy about that, but that's fine. I mean, you got enough fuel now. I got two canisters, man. One, uh, one uh, blue one and one metal one. Solid. He, he basically, he basically filled up my bag for me. Thanks. <laughs> that guy's probably so mad. He he's probably like, like All right, have to make some money. <laughs> he's probably like, why is this, why are these people out here? Why are these guys still here? <laughs> Little did he know. We got a fucking shit ass spawn. It just lined up perfectly. It was meant to be. Oh, my gun's full auto, right? Yep. Hush, Russian man, hush. Oh, wait, is there a guy right there? No, it's a light. Yeah, I, I get startled by everything in this place. There's mannequins, just keep that in mind. Like, I know it's hard to think of in the heat of the moment, but there are mannequins. Try not to shoot them. Well, that's metal. Okay. That bag right there's a death trap. Fuck that. Um, so straight. There could be six GP coins in there, and I wouldn't dig it. There is somebody in the Ollie computer room. Or the idea computer room. Pardon me. Okay. I'm just, like slow walking up there. Gunpowder. Gun. Pineapple juice. Apple juice. Alright, I'm going up. You're at the top, right? Yeah. Slow walking up here. I think he's still Oh, left. I see you. Now, where are we going? I heard some pressure to the left, man. Well, we gotta go right for my quest. The the one on the first floor is right here next to Idea. Alright, let's go there first. Just be careful. I thought there Ow. was a guy to the left. Ow. Bad yeah. fucking. Fuck you! Curious and kind of let down. Yeah. Pilot crash. Okay. That's a thing. Somebody just mag dumped something. Oh, I see him. Oh. Where's he at? Domed one. Domed one. Where's he at? Uh, big door right here on the left. He went left. Throw a grenade. Watch that way. He might be able to flank that way. Yeah. I domed his friend, though. I'm 
be going all the way around. Possible. We should probably move up on his buddy. Yeah. Probably gonna be beyond that broken wall right there. He ran that direction. Threw another grenade. Okay. Oh, he ran out. He went left. Left the hole. He's left. Back off your knee. Back off your knee. He's hurt as fuck. They hurt him again. Dead, 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 dead. Sorry, thick boy. Not today. Oh, he's not even that thick. Oh, he had a shroud mask. That's for you. Ouchy, ouch. You're hurt? Like, big hurt? Uh, well, my left arm was fucked. Fuck, I took a dog back back and put that back in the pocket. Okay, he had a TX-15. This guy had some PS rounds. He had a U-lock. I mag dumped. I'm gonna take his PS rounds if you don't mind. Go ahead. It's an alpha rig. Get an OP SKS and a Saiga and a PP19. Kind of rounds. These guys are all kind of lit. Loaded already. Yeah, PST. Nothing crazy. Yeah, just PST rounds. Oh, no, one mag of Luger CCI. And that shroud mask. That's always a cop. Do I want this alpha rig? No. Okay. Oh, fuck, I'm bleeding. Hello. Alright, I gotta heal up. My arm blacked out and I'm kinda of fucked up actually from the bleeding. Damn, Mumbles. Popped off. I'm super scared. Where in the open? He's got USEC armor on him if you want it. You don't want it? Oh, I, I actually I, appreciate that. I have an M1 rig on right now, so. Oh, okay, then, then can I take his alpha rig? Or. Yeah. Or, you don't want his alpha rig? No, I don't have a fucking space right now. Oh, they both had alpha rigs? Damn. Yeah, this isn't armored, though. This is an unarmored rig, just you know. Take his fucking alpha rig and take his buddy's USEC. Was the USEC shredded? Uh, I don't know. Actually, not really. Appreciate it. I'm gonna take this OPSKS though. Uh, give me one second. All right, oh. um, are you good to go? Uh, me? Yeah. Do you want to still try to do this quest or whatever? Nope. Nope? Okay, let's get out of here. I have a decked out TX-15 right now. Get it. And I have What's fuel, there? you have a lot of fuel. Um, it's gonna be Evercom or Railway, either one. Uh, uh Evercom. Evercom. When we're PMCs, we don't have both. It's just uh, Evercom. Really? Okay. Yeah. So back oh. of the building and get out. Hell yeah, I like to get outside first. Staying in the mall is a death trap. Man, I'd love um, to get the, 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 we're like right next to it, I think. Hold on. Uh, fuck it. We need to go out. Uh, pretty much the way we came in, just take a hard right. Yeah. Or we can go out the back this way. Whichever's closer. What do you want to do? Uh, let me see. Hold on. Don't kill me. Don't. Back way. Are they the ones who mag dump somebody, though? I haven't seen a third body. They might have just fought him and dipped.
Yeah, I got such a tight angle on that guy. He's there's no way he was gonna have that one. And I was being stupid aggressive with him. I kept pushing him even though you were shooting him. I was like accepting my fate if you don't me in the back of the head. Oh, I I was timing my shots between when you poked your head in and when you poked your head out. I'm gonna switch guns to the TX-15. Watch out for dudes chilling on the canopy. On the canopy? What do you mean? Okay, so let, let me come out here and show you. So that far canopy, way way over there. On the left and or the this right? Canopy, uh, on the right. Okay. And way way over here, this canopy right here, people can jump onto it. Okay. Not the one that, like closest to us, the one attached to the building. You get me? Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oh fuck me! Did I just break my legs? It's a it's a nope. hard jump. Well, I'm very oh. overweight right now. Oh yeah, so am I. Getting so much strength skill, I love it. My endurance hit level 18 today. I was like, God damn. That's what I'm talking about, baby. You saying Bolt don't got shit on us. You say Bolt. I am you saying Bolt. <laughs> kind of sad. I'm pretty sure he passed away, didn't he? Like last year. You saying Bolt? No. No. Yeah, just the other day he was at the NFL drafts doing uh, four O's. Oh shit. Eh. I didn't realize the TX-15 was a single shot gun. Why do you have a 60 round mag on a single shot gun? 60 round mags. Uh, to, uh, to, to click the mouse more. You want to figure <laughs> that out. To get carpal tunnel, you don't want to do that. It's not fun. Trust me. It has repercussions in the future. Oh wow, we were on the wrong side. It's this canopy that people can chill on. I oh, know. okay. Yeah. This is the one that you see that white one? That's the one that people can chill on. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. I swear to god if someone spawn can't or exfil camping over here, we'd be very, very upset. Now, if they were, that's where they'd exfil camp from with a sniper. It's also like the best way to finish uh shooter born in heaven. I didn't even finish the like, healing myself. My arm's fucking blacked up though. First time clear. X filling? Okay. Also, when people uh, don't have this X fill, they can hop into this green container here. Oh, really? The yeah. fuck? They get in the back of the truck and just camp it. That's like the dirty away. of the dirt. Yeah, man, because could you imagine we were just standing there and a guy just stands up? Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> Damn, yeah, I domed that first guy. <laughs> uh, level 37, level 19. Oh, I killed somebody too. Oh, that's right, I killed that hatchling at the beginning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> forgot about that guy. I'm pretty sure they saw me, or they were looking at me, because both their guns went from opposite directions. Like, so I could see the shadows outwards, away from each other, and then all of a sudden they both disappeared, so I'm assuming they both looked at me, because I was just standing in the fucking open, and then I domed one of them. Rip. Yeah, that dude just fucking fell flat on his face, and then his buddy started freaking out, he didn't know what to do. Yeah. Because the high-level guy, he was probably showing the low-level guy what to do. Yeah, so he just chilled there, he had a PP-19, and then some Luger CCI, it was, it was not going to work out for him. <laughs> Got me some pineapple juice. 
Yeah, he did two sixty round mags for this TX fifteen. What do you why? Fucking four backpacks out of that. God damn. for all the backpacks, guys. And I actually have fuel to start making fucking silly with kids getting screwed. <laughs> Biden's fourth is this guy's name. <laughs> I can insure dog tags. Can? Yeah. Oh wow. That's fucking weird. That's a big win right there. Oh yeah, for sure. Got a little weird, um, the magazine choices of that gentleman, but. All right, one more blue container and I can make another fucking mag case, which I cannot wait for because I have so many loose mags right now. Oh, <laughs> yeah, man. I already filled up my first mag case like instantly. Cool, so now I have more stuff that I need to use. God damn it. I go into games, I'm ready to die, it doesn't matter if I get out or not, and then I fucking get a lot more stuff. And then you just start getting stuff out of nowhere. Yeah. What the hell is this? Thanks for the U-Log helmet on them as well. Thank you. I was gonna try to take his contacts, but I literally had no room. I think I really need to start using big boy guns. <laughs> At this point, right, man? Might as well. Let's see, I have, an, I have three AKs, four AKs, RPK. I had to use this M1A EBR one game. Because I have the better M1A sauce with the suppressor somewhere. I don't know what the suppressor went for, but it's, it's here somewhere, I promise. Well, I'm um, ready to go back. <laughs> I am almost at that point. I got a shroud mask, so whenever I get that challenge to get all the streamer stuff. Dr. Lupo's coffee beans are pretty common. I've never seen shroud's mask. Some stuff just only spawns in certain places. They did that. Some uh, things only spawn at night. Some things only spawn in certain places. You know, it's a little weird like that. Wait, can I put this? Oh, I can put fuel cans inside of the fucking Lucky Scav junk box. I have so much loot. Nice. I need to put some stuff on the market. Because I have stuff uh, like this G Phone X for 19.4. Um, what else? I need the hard drives. I need the nuts and bolts. This GM counter, I don't even know what this is used for. Another pack of nails. Wow, pack of nails dove in price. Dope. Holy shit. shit. So I just sold one for 35k. Guess the price now. Twenty? Fourteen. Fuck. I just oh, sold one for thirty-five K. It is now God. fourteen. Yeah, that's dirty. Like what? That's fucked up. That that's an item that like if I ever got in a raid, I'd probably sit on until I went up that high again. 
guy. That's that's pretty pretty far. I'm gonna take this 60 round mag off this guy's gun and put it on fucking an actual M4 in case I need a mag dump. Is the recoil less? No, not really. Uh, actually, yeah, it is. The recoil is actually quite a bit less. Eh, a meta gun. It's not less on a, any other M4. It's less than the M4. It's like a smaller caliber SR25. What, the TX-15? Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. I bet, though, I bet if you tap fire with it, it's probably really fucking solid. Oh, absolutely. Don't doubt M995. It'll get the job done. I now have an OPSKS I can put a set on. So whatever we do factory runs, I'll probably be the next uh, victim in the factory. Yeah. It's either gonna be that or an MPX. Or the MP9, because I've got like three of those somewhere. I have like four MP7s too. Okay, I'm good. Cool. Oh, I forgot about this. Insurance. Interchange. 1555. Look at that, everything's already insured. It meant, like, I guarantee you the guy who looked at me first, too, was the low level guy. And he was probably like, Does that look like a guy over there? Is, is that a person? And the other guy probably turned and I fucking domed him. <laughs> what? <laughs> he, he's probably sitting there with his friend, like, Yeah, yeah, you see that? The, not that spot, that spot. No, 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 not that spot, that spot. And then he just gets fucking dumped. Fucking beast. Yeah, it's Tarkov. It's like this doesn't make move. any sense. My average lifespan in Tarkov is 57 minutes. How? What? Oh, so let's say, so if you exfil, I bet it continues in the next game. Really? Guarantee you. That's the only thing, that, that's the only way that would work. It has to be some stupid. So if you run into factory like 18 times and don't see a single person or don't die, like that that's probably one giant run. Like not the time in between the lobbies, but once you get in the game, I guarantee you it continues. Yeah, that makes sense. Feel it. New voicemail. I'm in the four, uh, 1600 lobby. Give me one second. I'm just going to get a quick copy. Did you send me an invite? Uh, I will right now. I can keep us while you go get that. Oh, uh, what do I have for a camera? What do I have a camera for a camera? C920 HD.
Bada bada bada. Waiting for players. Waiting for players, Jesus Christ. Eighteen seconds. shit. Okay, Bungus. Uh, time to come back. Like right now. Oh boy, oh boy, oh. Oh boy, oh boy, oh. Yes. How am I alive? Time to go. <laughs> You're in the worst spot possible. How the fuck am I alive? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about that. I wound up having to talk to my grandmother for a moment. Uh, whoop. I'm sitting there. I'm like, I'm like, uh, this is like the literally the worst spawn to get. Yeah. Worst spawn for this to happen at. Okay. All right, so where are we headed? Uh, Ollie right. and well, above all, you have to go to the second floor. So we're right oh. under Idea right now. Okay, so I gotta be on the first floor of Idea. So, actually, I think we're right under Hemel. I think I know where we're at. There should be a way to get into the left here if I know where we're at. Yep. So we're right under Hemel. Oh, we're under Hemel. It's a little weird, the parking garage is kind of confusing, but once you get the hang of it, it's not too bad. A lot of stuff down here too, weapon parts and shit. Totally check it out. Kind of try real. Oh, this is a way up. Yes, sir! So you go straight up through there, and that's the back of Hemel. This is where I, um, where I was saying that we should do the, the loot runs on interchange, which is basically take nothing. Okay. If we go through the back of here, the back part of this place has so much stuff. Dry fuel, 
loot, like, uh, barter goods and shit like that. Those guys are probably fighting at the computer area in front of Hemel. Maybe they're fighting where Killa's at. I wouldn't be surprised if people still do, like, insta-killer runs. There's a quest to kill him a hundred times, so... Jesus Christ. That's how people get the Adidas tracksuit, you have to kill him a hundred times. So if you see anybody with that Adidas tracksuit, that means, uh... That means they bullied Killa. That was a generator. So is idea to our right or our left? Idea would be the left. To our left, I think. Hold on. Yeah, that's that's like. Right Idea's right. to the right. It's to the right. Yeah. Okay. So that means Ollie's to the left. So we gotta go the Idea way. And you need to go to Ollie to go to the logistics uh, logistics office. A broken thing. No. Yeah. Uh, where'd you go? I'm like further towards the front of the store behind these crates. Boxes. By a flaming barrel. Okay, I hear you moving. I'll see you then. Are you buying an orange forklift or something? Um, no. I don't think that's pretty good. By the registers. I'm walking to the orange forklift. I'm at the orange forklift. I'm at the registers. You got the registers? Yep. Yeah. What the fuck are the registers in here? Uh, at the front. Fair. Oh, oh, hello. I would have been dead as fuck. What's up? Okay, so we can go through Bizarro right here. We also go this way, too. Uh, this is a little beefier, but yeah. Really? Okay. Yeah, there's loot here. It's like computer rooms here. I'm gonna open this door. Somebody's been in here, I bet. Clear. We can try to loot it. Leave the doors open there. It's very stressful without the doors open. Okay. Well, I need power cord. I need that. CPU fans, CPU fans, CPU fans. Do you need CPU fans for the quest? Uh, no. Okay. I just need a graphics card. Yeah, I need the drive starts too. I need a hard drives and power cords. Oh, this goes up. Oh. How far up does this go? Where does the staircase Wait. go? You said you needed power cords? Yeah. Come here. I got one. Oh, where am I? I don't know where I am. Oh no. I'm coming to you. Go back down the stairs. Go back down the stairs. Back up. I'm coming up the stairs towards you. What's up? Power cord on the floor. Thank you. How many more do you need? Uh, I think that's it, because I have two in my inventory. I have two there, so that's four. Yep, yeah, I'm good. I just need four hard drives. Cool. Hard drive shouldn't be too bad. Hold on, hold on, stop. There's a guy behind us. idea right in front of us. Okay, I'm gonna pre-med. This is stressful for some reason. Morphine. I knew it! I knew there was somebody back there! What are you shooting? I'm out! Fuck that guy! He Let him beef with whoever he wants. We're not here for him. We're here for our stuff. Uh, 
Ta-da! I think he's trying to find us. Oh. Uh, if he is, he's closer now. Door is still closed, so. That's either upstairs or downstairs then. What store do you need to go to? I gotta be honest with you. I think that might be from the garage, and that's why we hear it so well. Probably. What store do you need to go to? Uh, it's to the left here. Fuck it. Yeah, let's not beef with these guys. I gotta, I gotta focus my mind here. No beef, no beef. West. West. I got back end. I think it's this left store here. I might be wrong. Does it look like a bookstore to you? Uh, maybe there's shelving in it. All right, let's get in. This is the Embercom medical unit in front of us, so we gotta be careful. I have the key for here if you want to loot it. There's a lead spawn in there. I fucking hate this game. Fuck. So at this point, we've just jumped, so. <laughs> Sit behind the desk. Anything? Nothing. Starting to look less and less like a bookstore, more like a friggin' hospice unit. Where the hell are we? Gunshotter? Okay. Shotgun. Do you wanna look yes. it up real quick? Yeah, let me. We're kind of we're kind of sure. safe here, so. Let me know what the, what store it is. Okay. Yeah, it should be one across from us, actually. What what store are we in right now? Um, I have no idea. We're in the one across from the medical unit. Yeah, it's in it's it's in the one across from us right now, like straight in front of us where I'm going. Okay. I don't know where that nade was. I don't know either, but it sounded like it was more to the right. Yeah, it's that store. I, I saw that sign in the picture. Now, where's the book? It should be on one of these shelves. Hold on, let me take a look at the picture. Where the fuck is the book? Blue Goblin. Blue Goblin. Blue Goblin. Blue Goblin. That was risky. That was big risk. Got an MP5 upper. Which one of the bookshelves is it? It's just pointing to one of the bookshelves. <laughs> this is not a good indication. Here we go. If you need that, it's right there. Uh, I don't think I'm at there yet. But yeah, where, which one is it? Sorry, it's right here. I don't have it yet. Can we stop with the grenades, please? Yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> Alright, so we need to go second floor in Ollie. I also need to go to Ollie. Ooh, a weapons crease right here. Got big nuts looting that, you know that? Got a GL stock. And an AK-102. If you're a man focused on what's important, the loot. <laughs> Pretty much. Let's get out of here. Let's get the fuck out of here. What's this? BT. Is that a guy in Emercom? No, okay. I was about to shit myself. You want to go to Emercom Medical? I have the key. We can, use, we can loot it. Sure. Bunch of meds in there. The LEDX spawn. Where are you? Right here. Right, here, right. Okay. Which one's Emercom? It's to our left here. Okay. It's just like a little foggy uh, windowed area. You can shoot through this glass, just so you know. Don't be... And it's gonna sound like metal in here. Oh! What? A glass broke into the right. I don't know what it was. Get in here. Close that. Yeah, it's gonna sound like metal in here. Slow crouching. Me meds. I hear him. He's right here somewhere. To the left. I don't know. 
dead? Yeah. Solo? Looks like it's over. You keep aiming, I'm gonna try to leave this bag, see if it draws up the other guy. AKA, I just wanted to loot as well, so. We kind of do a two for two here. Let's keep looting. Wait to see if we hear something else. Because if he does have a buddy, he's going to do one of two things. Try to take advantage of us looting, or he's going to try to loot his buddy stuff and get out. One of those two things is bound to happen. Where is the lead expo on this building? Right where you found the vitamin thing, right here. You can also spawn in this tent right here. I have like five CPUs on me, Jesus. If I ever find a LEDX in here, I'm gonna start looting this thing every time I'm here. Because uh, I saw Pestily do a video on it, and he's never found a LEDX in here, but if I do, I will never stop looting this place. <laughs> well, this is kind of trash. Yeah, sometimes there's not much in here. Come on, let's get out of here. Contacts. I always liked insurance fraud. You got a pimped out VPO. Oh, damn. Whoop. I don't know why I brought this garbage armor. What's in his bag? Some grenade, an eye pack. Fleece. That's it? Okay, well, I'm gonna. I'm gonna fucking take his bird cut. I need backpacks. So. Yep. Stuff on loot. Wait, 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 wait. What do you have in his rig? Uh, 762, three mags, and then Vaseline. And split. Oh, these are 762 mags? I thought you would have the fucking. I'll take his Vaseline and use it. I thought he had fucking the, the Vepper ammo, you know, the 366. Oh, yeah. This guy's a big level for using that garbage ammo. What a weirdo. Yeah, he's using PS. Yeah, so. Shooting to the right of us. Yeah, I hear that. All right, become a snake. Crawl. It's like the loudest fucking thing possible. But they can't see us, so it's okay. We're snakes. All right, I say we just boogie. Let these guys do their thing, right? Oh, well, we need to figure out where we need to go. Hold up. You need to go to Ollie. Which is on the other side of the map. Correct the mundo, sir. So we need to come out of here and take a left? No, we need to go right. It's right here. That's right, right. I like to think of myself as a bit of a connoisseur of this map, right? I've ran in here a lot Woo! of times and died a lot of times. Look, the to the naked eye, you wouldn't assume that there's a Tetris there, but there is indeed a Tetris there. I'm getting shot at. Let's leave. <laughs> yeah, they're they're launching a lot of fragments down this way. Oh, you're right, we do need to go left. Okay, maybe I don't know this map. Okay, yeah, we can just shoot the window, that's fine too. I'm, I'm, I'm not taking any chances. We're done here, we're getting the fuck out of here. See, like I said though, naked eye, wouldn't assume there's a Tetris there. But, little do you know, Tetris. Free Bitcoin. This is dino clothes. Hold up. So Ollie will be to our left, right? Be down that way. Yeah, we go down the long hallway with dino on our right. Yeah. Let's go. Where are you at, killer fanboys? Pretty sure that's where they were peeping. It's a 
bag here in the middle of the hallway. Hey, run. Two. I'm dead. Ah. Two. They're thick. Kay. Watch out. Just wait. Just wait for them. They're coming right for me. Oh, they got me. <laughs> they threw me. Wait. I thought they didn't see me for a second. Someone threw nades at me as they went to go loot. They're dead. They're both dead. Are you serious? I heard two nades hit the ground right as I died. Oh my god. 7 and 31. Rip, fellas. Good job killing each other. You know what his name was? I am a god. <laughs> god damn it. <laughs> I thought they didn't see me when they were running through the store, so I was waiting for him to get past the mannequin, but he just started shooting me through the mannequin. Yeah, they were, they were thick. We gotta go back in there. Ah, oh, these books are so annoying. Take another ACAM. I'm gonna bring an M4. Probably a TV 110 rig. Some FAL mag. Oh, that's the ammo's not going into there. I'm bringing one of my crappier ARs. I'm gonna bring my 74M, do a cheap build on it. Big oof. The biggest of. Put sword and zone. I'm not gonna suppress it though. I'm just gonna fucking bring it as is. Oh, what? An AK 12? Fucking still card? That's not what I wanted. <laughs> Damn it. Actually, you know what gun would be really good for this place is fucking SVD. Actually, yeah. Especially if you put a canton sight on it. Pretty fucking good. Yeah, because I have the flip sight on it. Fuck it, I want to do it. 
I'll bring the M4, M4 next round. What ammo do I have? SMB in it. Dope. Just find a bunch of SMB today. Oh, I have two SVD mags. I'll bring a couple tens just in case. I'm over here, fucking Gucci. Uh, I am almost prepared. Almost. How are you on space right now? Pretty alright. I'm making more space as we speak now. I'm alright. Well, what's up? You're trying to do a scav? I was trying to... Uh, might, be, might be able to try to do a scav on uh, reserve again. Try to look for those stuff. Okay. I'm gonna try to do that. I'm for that. I mean, at least with a scav, like, I have the lucky scav junk box, at least for myself, so, like... Pretty much anything and everything goes in there. But I'm also okay with doing a PMC because I'm also not super fantastic on space. Again, trying to make room as we speak. Yep. Feel that. Oh, I still have the AK-105. forgot about that gun. I also have the EBR. You want to do a scab boy or you want to do a PMC? Up to you. Oh, I was just setting up for a PMC just so I could have more space. I... I could do either, and if we're gonna go to reserve, we can probably build up some more money like that. Yeah. Let's do it. Skyboy. I got an SKS. Oh, not short line. Reserve. Holy scabs looking for games now. Jesus Christ. Invisible Hulk. I'm coming for you. The Cheese. Zerk Night Glow. Mad Eagle Dude. I have a scav with an SV-98 with no sight, and it's weird. I have an OPSKS, it looks like. Scav vest and an army bag. So at least I have an army bag for the uh, battery if we find it. I got a fucking sling. If we find it. I got a sling, the micro rig, and no armor. No armor whatsoever. Yeah, I don't have armor either. I have the Derpy Riot helmet. Rip. I would toss that right off. Yeah, I usually do. Same thing with the, the really crappy earmuffs. I usually huck those off too. I usually use those. I use those for cheap runs that I don't want to take good headphones. Because the thing that sucks about them is that they amplify all sound. Yeah. But I, I kind of prefer that, especially in situations when I'm inside. Like... I won't really use them on factory or woods, but I'll use them like an interchange or customs and shit like that. Because once we're inside and a lot of the a lot of the ambient noise gets killed, like all the leaves moving and shit, yeah. pretty good. Helps out a little bit. And it's better than no earphones. It, it'll always be better than no earphones. True. I won't buy them, but I will use the ones I got from insurance. Also, I'm level 35 now, so dope. That means skier is max level. Yep. 
Didn't really Max realize Level's that. Max Level's just sells some more guns, and now he sells some, some pretty decent ammo. I think he's one of the people that sells M855A1, and he sells it for rubles instead of dollars. Solid. 300 rubles a pop. Oh, and he sells Luger CCI. Now, having max level skier or level 3 peacekeeper makes M4s a viable weapon. It makes them like a weapon you can use and not spend a stupid amount of money on. Same thing with 9 mils. Yep. Now you can actually run like PP19s and MPXs and shit like that and have backup Luger and not have to spend a ton of ammo, uh, spend, a, spend a ton of money. Yeah. And the fact that you've been making AP 6.3 and building it up is like the best way to go. And if you ever don't want to use it, just sell it. Make a ton of money. True. That is a good point. All found in raid. You can sell it on the market. That's what I should do, honestly. Is all the stuff I, mean, I make, I should just sell. I totally would, just because you can buy it for cheaper, so it's almost like the money you make from that. You use it to get the rounds you wanted anyways, and then you still make money. Yeah. Because I, I, what I could probably do, I need to check the price on... Prapper. But if I make it and then sell it all, and if I sell like a, si a stack of 60, how much money does that make? Because Prapper sells the 7N31, and how much can I buy it off of him for? Well, two things about that. One, it's an incredibly popular round, so he's almost always out of stock of it. The second it refreshes, you have to catch it as soon as it refreshes, otherwise, people will buy all of it super fast. Um, and you can only buy 90 rounds at a time. True. So, it's up to you. Totally up to you. But if you catch it when it refreshes and you do that, you'll still be making money. Because AP 6.3 sells for a little more than what Prapper sells 7N31 for. It's not going to be too much money made, but you're also getting a better bullet. So keep that in mind, too. True. It's almost like you're trading in your AP 6.3 for 7N31 and still making a teeny bit of money. And then, like, I mean, if you buy the red gunpowder and the bullets, probably not that much, but if you find it, it's definitely profitable. But if I was to go buy the red gunpowder and then buy the 100 rounds of PST I need, that would probably not make any money, if any, at all. Probably very little. I can't imagine that makes too much money when you buy the stuff. I, how much does red gunpowder go for right now? Uh, between 50 and 60. And how much do you make of the AP? 100. 100 rounds of it, and you buy 100 rounds of PST GZH, which costs nothing. It's probably like a few thousand rubles or whatever. And what can you sell 100 rounds of it for? You can probably sell 100 rounds of it for like 80, 90k, so yeah, you're still making money. True. I, I think it's usually about the same price as BP. AP sells for about eight, nine hundred rubles each. Hmm. Yeah, I have to look into it, see if it's worth it. I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. For sure. Cool.
damn, we're still fucking matching. Why are we still matching? Bugger, see there. Bugger, see muted. I hear it. I see your thing moving, but I don't hear you. Is it me? Well, I'll leave. Hello? Hello? Hey, it's alright. It's on a phone call. You backed out? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna back out now. timing because I just got a call that I have to take care of the ship financially. So, uh, I'll probably be back on in a bit. You said you were getting off at 4? Yep. Yeah, I might, I might get back on in like an hour. Okay. Alright, are you going to be on uh, again later today or you're done after 4? Uh, depends what the girlfriend does. All right, if she ends up playing video games then I'll jump back on, but if she ends up just hanging out, I'll probably just hang out. Cool, bro. Just let me know. Deuces. Deuce, man. GG's. GG's. All right, chat, what do we do now? I guess we gotta interchange and try to uh, go on the Ollie. Oh, he has the delicious office key though. I think we do need to go scav run though. I do want to go on reserve just to look for that stuff. Maybe being solo will get in a little bit easier. The thing is about dying to those thick boys, they're probably not going to pick up our stuff. Reserve is so hard to get into. I just want to get the loot. If we don't get in this time, uh, we'll probably go to interchange. I feel like reserve, there's not enough PMCs on here for scavs. So no one's going to reserve anymore.
Hello, maybe, maybe not. We'll get it till about 3.30, four, four minutes, and then uh, we'll probably back. I'm going to change. I need to get those bullets in the military battery. We'll go ahead and change. I don't know why reserve is so hard to get into. This game also lags so hard when getting out. I don't know why. Okay, boy. Interchange. Maybe we'll get some either PSUs, hard drives, any power cords, GPUs. If we get a super late raid, what we'll probably do is run it, run like just sprint into the main mall, um, and try to get a GPU or something like that from the tech stores. Matching again, really? Is no one scabbing or no one PM PMCing today? Like what? Preparing game. Thank God. Gunpowder? No. Relay? Nice. Wrench is trash. Alright, well, that's the money right then and there. 
We're still gonna go inside. Um, should we? Or should we dip out? Because we got red gunpowder. We got a corrugated hose. We might just dip out. Now nah, we'll go in. So we got 25 minutes in. Oh, lag. T plug, screw knot. Good. Oh, this is already looted. Just access. Yeah. This is idea, right? Uh, yeah, this is idea. We really need a propane tank. Or alkali heat surface washer stuff. footsteps over there but apparently not Just gonna take this and dip out. We got about a hundred K on us, so we're just gonna let we're just gonna leave. but it's also kind of a little bit safer. <sighs> Got a lot of junk. So when I get out, probably gonna sell the fuel.
still in the building. And probably what we'll do afterwards is probably jump into factory, maybe. Ready to get into factory. We get like five more kills, I think, with pack armor. Probably only go factory like once though, because pack armor, I think we only have one more. I don't want to buy any. Because no one's going to pick them up, they're going to just get returned from insurance, so. Well, you don't lay down. So you'll stay moving. If I had a little bit better shot on him, I probably would have had him. Quick and easy read, though. Made some money. Sell that. That'd be put fuel in there. Forgot about that. this I already have pack armor okay dope So we'll bring 30 PS. And Zaraya. Oh crap, no, I don't want to bring a backpack. No backpack. We're going for beef, not loot.
Patching. Why is factory taking so long? I hate being forced to wear armor. There we go. Holy mother of pearl. Oh, are you serious, dude? Did I hit him at all? Ninety-three damage to his body. Dang. I'm just gonna bring PS rounds in now.
This is right, yeah, there we go. Okay. Say you're matching again. I don't know why matching is taking forever in factory. What? I don't know where he got me from. Re oh my god, dude, I'm doing so much damage, but I'm not finishing it.
See, we have another five, maybe five, five. Hundred and three K. Oh, health. Health. Try reserve. If you can't get reserve, we'll go ahead and change again. This is gonna take forever. We'll give it to like four minutes and then we'll go interchange. Hey! Oh, it is cowboy hat too.
Jesus Christ, multiple breaks. Oh, this is PRS, we'll drop from this. Hey man, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Cigarettes, crackers, 
Marlboro's cigarettes. Oh, we traded. There is two of them, too. Oh, we're both scavs. 247 damage to his body. Oh, boy. Big oof. Thank you guys for all the likes today. Yeah, it's been fantastic the last couple days. Had a lot of good streams recently. Okay. Uh, let's go... Let's go lose this up for. So, any of these cab kills, and when you go to the lodgy office. Big sale. I hope the site goes over this uh, laser. Oh, loading Ludo already? Alright, dope. I just realized I don't have any armor on. I meant to put on a TV 110 rig. Players, please don't late spawn me again. I don't want another four like four minute late start on interchange.
if we're in power, of course we're on the opposite side. Why am I lagging? three Oh, the lag. Why are we dropping so many frames? It's not me, it's the server. We're gonna go out on the left.
like right out here to the left. Definitely out here to the left. So Kai was open. So we need a logic key. So if we're I think I know where we are. So you're here. What 
What did he hit me with? If I walk into the store, I need to go to the right side. behind there. Okay, so we need to go out of Ollie. So we kind of need to go the same way we just went. I'm kind of scared. So Aaron Wilson for a second.
Крепко, ебана! Ебатки парика! Чего, блядь? Good. Okay, we're good. Wait, are we here? So if I go this way... Go the back side of Hamel and go into Kaiba. Twenty two minutes. Oh, the lag.
So quiet. Okay, so this last door on the right, on the left, will be the cafe. We go into the cafe and then we can get in the pretty lights. And then we're right there with Kaiba. So it's still fighting at Kaiba. I can't tell what that other gun is. Пиздец, омраки ебаные! Давай, давай, давай! Пошел, пошел! So they're literally right behind me.
can't tell what that gun is. Sounds big though. They finally kill him. So I think they just killed Killa. Sound like one other scab or at least another person. Huh? It's the riot grenade. My goal is let them have the beef. And then I'll just run in there like last second. Cause there's no way I'm these guys are thick. They've been dumping rounds. That is Zariah. They're at 12 minutes. They're probably looting him now. If I didn't have that folder from Ollie, I'd probably go in there right now, but. I'm trying to hit two birds, one stone here. gun is that? That is fucking loud. the player chat Where's hole in the fence? Oh, I'm dead. 
didn't have no backpack. These guys are still fighting. These guys gotta leave at six minutes. They have to. Uh, dude, chat. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm assuming they just took down Killa. I gotta start pushing that way.
Fuck you! Sports, where is sports? Oh, we're not here. Chat, where is Kaiba? It's this door right here, what the fuck? Is it not open? I'm so confused. Is this supposed to be Kaiba? Wait, right here? Oh, someone never opened it? Wait, is it this pallet? Oh, bro, it wasn't even in Kaiba. to go into Kaiba. I thought you had to go into Kaiba. Oh well.
Yeah, done though. Is that a gear quest? Yeah. Stash three gold chains under the mattress next to BTR 80A. Stash three gold chains in the microwave on the third floor of dorms. Stash three chain gold chains in the middle accommodation unit of the sawmill. Till 5 p.m. See on, operates on interchange in the time period from 2300 till 10. What? what kind of garbage is that? Fifteen. Oh God. Eight moonshine. How much is a single moonshine? Is that something I can make? Can I make moonshine? Cause boy oh. <coughs> oh Jesus. <coughs> Why is he still huffing and puffing? Sugar and keck tape. Just solid. I should still like an in and out raid. Yeah, let's do that. Hold on. Um, I do want to do this before I forget. Just because. And a bank robber rig. Here's the plan. We're just going to yeet in. Get what we need. And yeet out. Well, uh, 
didn't bring any painkillers. Oh, I bring painkillers so I can painkill up and just yeet in. We're just gonna full sprint into Ollie. Get in the office, grab what we need, get out. Please don't be a late spawn. So I think what we're gonna do too is just go right through the front door of Ollie. So I think we're gonna make our way outside wherever we spawn and run up and run back, grab it and go. And I can do a hole in the fence because I don't have backpack. Then we'll probably run a couple um, factory runs. Waiting for players, which means we're probably going to get late spawn. Gotta make sure I tell Bungus too that we don't need to go into Kaiba. It's going to be outside Kaiba. Where does the Kaiba key spawn?
I think I'm here. No, I'm definitely here. So we all left. We spawn in late. Forty seconds. This is power. So I do want to go this way.
CPU fan caps. Still pain killed. How much longer? 107. It was level three or four? Four. Okay, that's actually about better at all. Okay, so we have Emercom, Power Station, Scav Camp. Where is Scav Camp? out the front, take a left, and then take a left around the building. Somebody at the front of the store, I don't know if it's a scav or a player. I see a propane tank.
feel like I hear somebody on metal. Yep. Oh, are you serious? That's annoying. I super hate Xville campers. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for today. I do have to get off um, go Zoom with the family. Uh, thank you guys so much for joining me. Make sure to drop a like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell so we do go live. Uh, we will be live next. Today is Saturday, so Monday night uh, we'll be live playing this game. Tuesday we'll be doing D&D. &D. Um, Wednesday, I forgot, uh, Halo 3 ODST came out, so we're probably going to be doing that on Wednesday night. Um, unless everybody wants to get on Tarkov, then I can push back that because I don't have that much of a connection to... Um, ODST was more of a Halo 3, Halo 4, uh, Halo 1, 2, and 3 um, person and reach. Um, but I'll definitely be uh, playing this Monday and then um, Halo 3 ODST on Wednesday. Thank you guys so much. Have a good night. Goodbye.
Deuces.